to the highest G and then to Beagle Point. However, I may, I don't know why, but I may actually add a stop to this trip just because someone pointed it out to me. There's a black mm -hmm. hole at the top of the galaxy. Mm. And I'm tempted like to... A big, like, a, like a super black hole or... No, oh, there's only one super massive. I don't that, know. And that's the one at Sag A, right? Well, mm -hmm. there's two, I believe. The Great Annihilator is a super massive, mm -hmm. I believe. Uh, and then those Sag are both super massives. Yeah, that have been found. Uh, you said 11 found? I don't think so. Mm -mm. You don't think Ow. what? You don't think what? That have been found. Mm -hmm. That's what you said, not 11. 11 that have been found or two? No. No. Are you insane? Only two great massives. I'm gonna slap him. I found a couple hundred black holes. All Which leads us to our next point. Don't smoke crack. Crack is bad, okay? Smoke is bad. <laughs> alright, alright, let's get to this. Fuck you! I'm tired. Oh, I am too. Oh, fuck are you? I literally just started drinking an energy drink to uh, to do this this thing that we do. Because we're the only energy. one we got. But you don't drink the right ones. One, say no to crack, but this one's got cocaine in it. Cocaine. Yeah. Cocaine. <laughs> caffeine and sugar, man. Fuck all that extra chemicals and shit. Just, just caffeine and sugar is all you need. <sighs> Did you Cheeks oh, clapped I... by who? <sighs> oh, Are you okay. sure it's in PCs? Because you did go to... <laughs> Get out of there, man. Are what you the sure they're NPCs and they're not players? Mm-hmm. Oh. Well, I'm gonna have to sense hole again. Just a warning. Um, Kirk, warning for you. Any populated system that has engineers or an unlockable Why system the with... living fuck are you in that system? With a permit or something? Who? Um. Kirk. Okay. Because Komate is, um, that's a player system. Um, there are a lot of grapers that will just blow you up for just seeing you. And they always hang out. Um, engineering systems, certain mat grinding systems, permit lock systems. Take a look at my girlfriend. She's the only one of that. So you're drinking your energy drink, so I'll drink my coffee. What you eating? An orange. I've had a pot of coffee and three energy drinks ready today. Reese. I'm tired as hell. That's probably <laughs> why it's called a crash. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, Too much. Now I got body five hours sleeping. I'll go to bed. Five mm -hmm. hours? That's an average. Well, fuck that shit. I'd die if that was my average. God, if I sleep, I, I feel like shit the next day if I get more than five hours of sleep. I get between five and seven. I right, start say I either sleep for four or eight, nothing in between. No, I don't <laughs> function with gray. Four hours and I'm good to go. Hello, Pale pink penguin. Work? Um, I'm just gonna call you P3. The whole party? At this game? Oh my goodness. I hope that man shut up, so... Oh yes, please go on. With what? What are we going on with? I don't know. The whistling was turning me on. Oh. No, please stop. Wait till he sings. You 
Let me guess, you've got some popsicles in the basement. Hell yeah! I'm in Florida, we don't have basements. Why? Because <laughs> if you dig three feet down, you're hitting water. Oh. I think this is one of the funnest plants I've ever been on for uh, SRV ah. mining. I'll be there soon enough. You'll probably be in bed by the time I get there, old timer. <laughs> They're too afraid of basement gators. Base gators. Oh, that's a calm down there. Gator. Okay, whoever is the the three P guy, you're loud one second, you're quiet the next. Please pick a location for your mic to be in and leave it there. Yes, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> is this good? No, it's yeah. not good. No. Quite frankly, it'd be better if you were in a different party. You're you disrespectful. Get the fuck. Hey, brother, man. Why don't you do a do me a favor? What 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 do you want me to do, buddy? What do you want me to do there? What do you want me to do, you there, sissy boy? What you got there, sissy boy? Dumbass. Yeah. Nobody heard anything you just said. <laughs> yeah, I blocked him. Like, no one heard you at all. Was he six when he made up that insult? I have yeah. no idea. I don't know what he said. He's still muted, so I won't be able to hear what he says. He said, suck your mom, you fucking fish. Suck your mom, you fucking fish. Okay. Mm -hmm. So he is a child. Gotcha. Yes, he's a child. Like I said, six, because that's, that's weak sauce. Weak sauce, yeah. Weak saucy nussy. It's not even weak sauce, it's like weak powder. <laughs> to be completely honest, if anybody tries to just throw an insult at somebody verbally, I honestly think that's childish, like, period. Unless you're doing it for a Oh yeah? Well, your mom's Unless so fat, she plays pool <laughs> with the planets. Ribbing each other, sing it, sing it in just as fun. Bye. Yeah, I was pretty sure that's why he was there. Oh, his friend, you think? Yeah. Yeah, his friend was rude. I like Kirk, though. You darn. I'll kill him when I get back to the fucking bubble. <laughs> just save his name and just hunt him down. I will find you. I will find you and I will kill you. <laughs> and then you will suck my piss. <laughs> it's just my piss you will be sicking. Oh. That was like worse than a child's insult. <laughs> so horrible. It I'm was there. more it was well, comical than an insult. Hopefully that was the intention. Because if it was like the actual intent there, then I'm... I, I worry. Sorry. I feel sorry for his piss. <laughs> I, actually, I actually like the caramel one of those better than the vanilla. Hey, Smokey. Yeah. You missed it. Uh, where are you in the galaxy? Mm -hmm. I'm hitting the death hole. You want to execute someone? <laughs> yes, yes I do. Oh, kill order. His yes. name is Lord Thanatos. You can shoot him anytime you want. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is he, is he still calling you, uh, you yep. know, the name that you hate? Yep. <laughs> Until he stops. Shoot him, just tell him that it's from uh, my regards. He's been warned. <laughs> and I told him that. I said, dude, I said, there are people that are going to be hunting you down because you keep calling me that. And he laughs. Like, you don't think anyone's going to go after him. Nah. I've already killed before, like time for doing that. Before I t was taking it to the pits, once I had mentioned that there was two supermassive black holes in the galaxy. Yeah, um, I know there's three for a fact. Um, Great Annihilator is two supermassive black holes that are binary to each other. And then um, mm -hmm. Sad J is a supermassive, well, so that's technically three. Yeah, they're talking about maybe two in the center, but I never heard of two on the, uh, you know, away from the center. Yeah, uh, Great Annihilator is it's a binary supermassives. Yeah. Wow, where is In that the located? Does that name the system Great Annihilator? Yeah, Great Annihilator. Mm -hmm. You know, it has to be a million times it, uh, bigger than the sun, so 
Worlds. If you make it to Colonia, reset your filter for just non sequence stars I've, and that'll pull up I all was the fixing to say, um, Smokey, um, whether you believe this or not, I've actually been to the Great Annihilator uh, three times. Uh, I assure you it's there. <laughs> just saying. I've been there. It's there. It's there. Yeah. Kind of on the way. Yeah, it's 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 on the w it's in between Sage and um, the bubble. You just gotta head out to the right just a little bit, probably about 500 light years off of the straight and narrow. Pretty sure if you just type it in, it'll come up. If I'm not mistaken, yeah. it might be actually in your squadron bookmarks. Let me look. Give, give you those bookmark or those uh, planets, Fox. Yeah, yeah. You t t fucking email them to me now so you don't forget, fucker. <sighs> fucking dick. <laughs> it ain't my fault I'm not gonna be around. Uh, oh, yeah, shit. it is my fault. But yeah, it is, bro! <laughs> <laughs> the hell this it is, ain't! <laughs> this is when you say, I don't wanna talk about it. <laughs> Somebody spell annihilator. Yes. A N N I H I L A T O R. That one. Is it O R or E R? O R. Alright. There we go. Um, open it up. It's there. I just type in great annihilator and there it is. You able to search bookmarks? Smokey, he's live if you want to, like, see where it's at. Black holes are typically the remnants of supermassive stars. And there it is. Hey, it actually worked. All I had to type in was great. Mm -hmm. Eh, maybe. There's two fleet carriers there as we speak. Holy shit, that is way up close. I can like, see where I can do it on the way back. All right. How many more jumps do I have here? Ten. Player sent an 12. image to one of the group. Okay. Um, and the, the Zahara, but we've been to the Formidine Rift. Um, I think the Conflux Alpha, or the Conflux Sites towards Clonian, I think Hawkins Gap is towards... Uh, Right side of the galaxy facing. Um, yeah, I know where Hawking's Gap is. Yep. Yeah. I want to munch on something, but I'm not hungry. Does that make sense? I'm on my way. Yep. Just kidding. <laughs> you keep your curly hair in there. <laughs> fucking perv. Talk about everybody else being a fucking perv. Hey, you can chew on my finger. I mean, it doesn't have huh? to be sexual. You said you want to gnaw on something. You're not hungry, so I mean. I know what yeah, I'm craving. Yeah, want something besides your finger. I'm craving. Uh, the, I'm craving the, the beef great, jerky, but the Great Annihilator mm -hmm. is only 198 solar masses. That is not a uh, supermassive black hole. Well, according to the game, it was. No, it's. It's a micro, they call it a micro quasar. It's the largest next to the, uh, next to Sagittarius. So you gotta have a, a million solar masses to be considered a supermassive black hole. Listen, Mr. Fucking Details. Not don't when the, make me not when you. the game was created. <laughs> In 1985? <laughs> I don't think it was 85. I think it was 84. The game was actually created in 82. Um, the first playable, yeah, first playable was 84. The demo was released in 83, but it was only released to two different publishers to try to gain funding. I was trying to be that Pacific. Specific. Atlantic me alone. I like Pacific. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> oh man. Let's 
So, what's everyone doing other than just picking on each other? <laughs> well, my hole's down to 22% already, and I, or like I said, I've already uh, sent the hole twice, and the second one I did was 100%. Oh, no, I, I forgot did. to tell you. Um, according to this game, Smokey, um, the galaxy is now only a one-fourth replica. It is no longer a one-to-one -one ratio. Did you know that? I, I heard about that, but I, I, yeah. I haven't really seen any sources on that. Now scientists are saying that our galaxy is four times the size that we thought it was, and it's no longer disc-shaped. It's actually a sphere. Oh, yeah. and uh, not only are we a sphere rather than disc shape or as a spiral galaxy shape, it's actually a sphere. Um, we are not projecting that we will collide with Andromeda in the future. Uh, we already are. The Andromeda galaxy and, uh, and ours is already colliding. So, I mean, we could have already passed it and then we're coming back at it. I mean, that, that is a possibility. You know what I say? Yeah, that's, that's not what they're saying. Doesn't fucking matter. We have no control over it. We'll yeah, really. Oh no, we're all gonna die in three billion years. We're all gonna die. Ooh, no. Actually, I wouldn't say three billion. If we're already colliding with a galaxy, um, Mark, several hundred million. It could be in a couple weeks, and we wouldn't even know it because the shit would come out of nowhere. Exactly. <laughs> it doesn't fucking matter. Nobody knows. Everybody's gonna oh, die someday. Everybody's gonna die someday. Yeah, I gotta die of something. Might as well die of fear, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, what killed you? Oh, two. I was scared to death. <laughs> two galaxies collided. Oh man! You know, I, I what watch this. You? I watch shit all the time on this, and I've not heard that. What, you got some links to that? Yeah, actually, I do. Give me a second. I'll look it up for you. Yeah, I would love to read that. Oh my god, you guys are awesome. I have not seen any of that on the new, you know, how the universe is made. Or... Don't you know most of that shit's made up and guesses? Oh, of course. It's all Just theory. like the planet being round? It's yeah. not round, damn it. <laughs> it's obtuse. Um, the NBC, NBC News released it uh, two years ago. Um... Let's see. How many scientists are backing this theory? Is it just a couple, or is it? No, it's quite a few. Um, here, are you are you on my stream there, Smokey Smoke? No. Uh, no. No, I'm not. Well, do me a favor. Uh, tune into it for just a moment. You ain't got to stay there. And let me go back to my stream here, and I'll post it in the chat. Here you go. Excuse me, sorry. Fucking shit's contagious. Random he gave fucking that shit hiccups. to me when I married him. I know he did. STD, baby. Shrinking toe mm. disease. Fuck that shit. That's a I'll very mean. that's a abbreviated version of what we're talking about. I just posted it in the chat. a live link um anton petrov he's a uh, i believe he's georgian interesting and he actually I that particular video him already. i don't think he chooses know, to live uh, in georgia i think he was born there but i uh, look to see where i'm where i'm fucking following i don't even fucking know um just go to youtube search uh, chaotic Fox, two different words, okay. leave the H out of chaotic, and it'll have me live. Click on the live, and in the chat, um, there is a link. It's the only thing there, because the only ones watching are myself, Lara, and probably no. Reese. <laughs> I found a supply of this plant. looks like it's been plowed for, like, farming. Cool. Like lying, or, or plowed for other reasons. And you can subscribe to his channel. He um, he reports a lot on astronomical knowledge, or shall we say, astronomical theory. But he does not offer very much opinion at all. He is very good at just reporting what's written. Just the facts. Hell. Yeah, he's really good at just putting the facts out there. Which one? Just chaotic facts, right? Yes. No agent chaotic. Yeah. 
Two words. Yeah, spread it apart. Yeah. Gotta spread her legs. To, to spell it without the H, otherwise it'll just search the normal word. I'll be right back. You gotta be very Pacific. <clears throat> very Pacific. Specific. Specific. We're not a fucking ocean. Okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> Uh, anyone, uh, anyone know? who didn't know, oh, somebody's typing. Hold on, I'm crashing into a star here. Yellow ticket. Hey, I blame Laura. Ha <laughs> ha. What's up, ticket? Ticket, can you see the link that I posted two minutes before you joined the channel? Oh, I don't fucking want to subscribe to you. It must be my little account. I don't know. People subscribe daily and and cancel their sub or unsubscribe daily. Is this this uh, YouTube I O S D ninety P C E I? Uh, mine is watch no, question no, no, mark V one... equals P. A huh? No, no. I'm saying the link that you shared. YouTube OSD underscore 9DQ. Yep. Yeah, that's okay. it. Um, that should take you to the video that I'm referencing, and he's pretty yep. good about putting his references in his description. And like I said, he's also really good about not offering his opinion. Anton Petrov, yes. And he doesn't do conspiracy theories or anything like that. He literally just reports the scientific community's latest and if it contradicts something that he's said before he will reference his old video and say the changes you know he, he doesn't whoa what the fuck how many jumps am I got two okay you'll be here in two jumps uh no two till I get to the neutron plane and then well, I'll listen to it later yeah just save it till later man but yeah, you'll find that very interesting. We've decided that our galaxy is now four times larger than than we thought. Still wondering what happened to the man from Kentucky. Whose dick was so long he could suck it. And claimed that if his ear was a cunt, he'd fuck it. You disgusting bastard, you. <laughs> You're the kind of person that looks at ink blots and sees women with medium breasts, aren't you? Hell no, big old kitty. You, oh, you see, you see women, kitty. women with large breasts when you see an ink blot. Gotcha. <laughs> you realize that the ink blot test is actually designed to. Uh, Recognize and diagnose um, sexual disorders. I like big old titties. How was that a disorder? Tig of tig old bitties. <laughs> in as much as if you see anything sexual at all in the ink blots, they consider you a deviant. Oh, I'm done. I don't need an ink bot. I can tell you now, I'm a TV. Well, it was it was funny. the The whole point of it is because in the movie Armageddon, Rockhound, when they gave him the ink blot test, his responses were, "Women with a woman with large breasts, a woman with medium breasts, a woman yes. with no breasts." <laughs> you with breasts. And the test is to find out if you're deviant or not. And all he saw was a woman with breasts. You know? <laughs> that was hilarious. Alright, gentlemen. I'm you off to bed? Yeah. I'm not gonna fall asleep on the mic. Why not? Maybe we uh, want you to fall asleep on the fucking mic. We wanna hear you snore. You don't wanna hear me snore. I've snored so loud I've woke myself. Oh, that sounds amazing. <laughs> Where the <laughs> hell am I going? Later, dude. Here, this is where we're going. Come here, you little son of a bitch. Okay. Let's go down to 1100, right around here.
I'm back. Well, hello, back. I have returned. And, um, yellow ticket, it's not my fault, it's your fault. I saw you say you blamed me. Mm-hmm. 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 Sure. Anyway. Um. I thought of another tutorial to do, so I went and made one really quick. Who's laughing, laughing at you? Right? She's laughing at me. No, There's one. Um, I literally used a neutron star, and I'm just sitting here like, oh, this is pretty blah blah. And then I was like, wait a second, that might be a good tutorial for like a minute tutorial. Of how yeah, to how to use a star. neutron. So. Then you should go to Myopotus and say, and this is how you use a white dwarf, and just crash into it and die. <laughs> Uh, I said I honestly uh, I don't mess with white dwarves. Don't. <laughs> I, I said I personally don't mess with them. Um, I don't even use them. <laughs> they don't even give you a jump range anywhere near as much as a neutron does anyway. So. I, said I know what I'm going to munch on. I said I wanted beef jerky, and you didn't tell me that we had little baby steaks in the refrigerator. We don't. You ate them. Yes. Grr. I mean, I can fall somewhere out and cook more if you want. No, I'll just I'll just munch on some chicken pineapple pizza. Okay, sounds good. You but want I some? Totally ate. No. You said it sounded good. For you, sounds good for you. How do you know what sounds good for me? You don't have my fucking Cause appetite. Because you, you said you wanted it. You, you eat it. You okay? I mean, always, yeah. Just, n those noises are normal. Mm, they shouldn't be. Coach says Cody, it's normal to have blood come out of your ears. Mm -hmm. Old man noises. I know, no, right? It's not, <laughs> it is not an old man noise. It is a people are bullshit noise. This is All right, we've got 93 time. jumps. <laughs> I'm going to eat a piece of pizza first. You can definitely pizza, pizza. blame me for eating I landed on a piece of because I landed on a piece of pizza today. Eating the baby steaks, yeah. Pacific. Mm -hmm. Specific. Do you not know English? Like, what the fuck is wrong with you we guys? We can be as specific as we want. Oh, now I'm doing it on purpose. You want to go fucking go go fishing in the ocean? Go fucking jump in the water. Go play in the sand and buy post. me a or metal a detector so I could go play in the sand too. <laughs> you fellas ain't right. We ain't right. I don't want to be wrong. They see me rolling. They hate them. Someone trying to catch me riding dirty. Catch me dirty. riding dirty. No. You motherfuckers ain't right. You ain't right in the head. Oh, right, no. oh my god, are you fucking kidding Ticket me? says he I wants to go you. swimming in the Pacific Ocean. Oh, fuck you all. Fuck all of you. <laughs> you all suck. You should have said, I, I seen it. Specifically in the ocean. Mm -hmm. <laughs> which one is, I know this is going to sound like really stupid, but which one is the Pacific? The one on the right or the left? Left. Okay. Oh no, can we beat that Pacific? <sighs> that depends, I'm Lara. You and kill you. Lara, are you standing on the ground looking out or are you standing in space looking down? Um, I am. Um, well, which way is your head facing? Are you standing north, uh, south, I, or south, I, or south, I, north? I would like to be facing, like looking at a map. Like the United States is in front of me on a map. So to you're you're in space right. looking down. Yes. There you United go. States to the left. The map or the top of the map? Okay. How do you know you're not looking up? Oh, After a good point. That's a very good point. If you look at the map upside down, then yeah. You all I'm like sideways. fucking with me way too much. <laughs> we told you, you gotta be. Oh, you, you just just be glad. 
you didn't say standing on the ground looking up. I'm like, oh, okay, well, what direction are your, are your nipples facing? Uh, well, hey, some girls, it could be Because you can, you can look straight up and the right moves, you know. <laughs> You're going to have to point your nipples some direction. Oh, my God. If your nipples are pointing or, toward Texas, it's on the right. If your nipples are or, pointed toward Minnesota, it's on the left. <laughs> or if you're old enough, your nipples might be, your head might be pointing up, your nipples are pointing down. If your nipples are pointing down. Get a bra? Got some <laughs> saggy titties. My boobs don't sag. Who, sag. who has ever sag. seen a woman over the age of 30 that has not, re that has not already begun to sag? Uh, uh. A, a girl had an A cup. Okay, that that does make sense. But actually, I have seen A's that start to sag a little bit if they have anything more than nipples. No, this girl barely had an A. She, I guess she could be called like a double A. Like right, it's called a, it's called a nearly A, but I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah, she, she had. She's I got puffy guy. nipples. Yeah. Not even puffy, just tiny. Yeah, the yellow yeah. ticket says it's called gravity. <laughs> <laughs> called bra. Yeah. <laughs> wear one. No, thank you. No, oh, no, you wear you wear bra your entire life, and by the age of thirty, you're gonna have some natural sag. You'll actually have a crease on the bottom of your tits because of it. Well, I'm not gonna lie. I hate bras, and I rarely wear them. I recently just mm -hmm. found some. Um, that I can wear because of religious reasons. I haven't been able to find one for years. I decided to make my own, <laughs> so now I have some. <laughs> but I finally found some. Now I don't feel all awkward in public when I'm wearing a t shirt. <laughs> any man of mine that d any, mine. any man that, that dislikes saggy titties, or at least some sag in titties either likes a flat chested man boy um lady boy i meant or is a pedophile because i mean like i said any tits larger than an a are going to start to sag um within a decade and a half or two yeah they start getting them when they're about 12 or 13 by the time they're 25 they're starting to they're starting to sag it doesn't matter how well you treat them the bigger them titty the bigger them seconds mm-hmm um just I remember personally. that, guys. The bigger your balls, the lower they're going to hang. Oh Funny, God. though. No, no, no matter how big your dick water. is, it ain't going to hang. <laughs> that toilet Gravity water does water. not affect a dick. It just don't. <laughs> Unless you put, like, a you know four-pound stud through the dick. Yeah. Then you, some then you have issues. I don't, I don't think that works like you think it does. Sandbags. But you're welcome to try it. <laughs> There's an Asian guy who puts like you sandbags you, on his balls. <laughs> yeah, but why would anybody want to do that? Don't um, judge me. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, man, I'm almost 40. Almost 40, and I can't jog without them things smacking me in the asshole. I mean, I couldn't imagine them being worse. Takes care of the foreplay, I guess. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well then. <laughs> I'm sure glad that I selected that. Is this stream suitable for children? No. No. <laughs> Negative Ghost Rider. Negative Ghost Rider. definitely full. Oh man. Someone, someone said something to me a couple of years ago when I was streaming. They were like, you need to learn how to edit. I was like, do you not realize that the gameplay for this game is 95% boring? I said 95% of the excitement in this game is the fucking conversation is in the background. So stop trying to watch it muted and listen to what's being said because there's your yeah. entertainment. Yeah, that's you know? definitely the entertainment. <laughs> that's, why, that's why a lot of people actually like our streams, because we're not afraid to just be ourselves and be honest and, and just talk. And say wacky ass and shit and let yeah, it roll. And yeah, enjoy ourselves, yeah. Have a have a flat earth discussion where, where, where one of us says, okay, I'm going to be the flat earther. Change my mind, you know? <laughs> I, I can even grasp the mindset of that. Oh, God. 
it's it's Some actually very it's actually very very oh. simple to grasp the concept. Mm -hmm. um, imagine, listen, no, 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 listen, listen, listen. Imagine having never read anything scientific in your life and only having the basis of knowledge of what you have seen with your own eyes. And the answer to your question is going to be, how do you explain a rainbow? Stupidity. Now, so ignoring the rainbow, in the past, right, so I say ignoring the, the rainbow, it, it just, w having the knowledge of only what you read in the Bible, Bible doesn't tell you the world's flat, by the way, it doesn't, I've read all no, of it. No, it doesn't. But it doesn't. But, igno ignoring the fact that everything that you may have learned in school, and, and being paranoid enough to think that everything you did hear from school or any knowledgeable source is some type of clever deception trying to dumb you down and, and, and okay, so I just, just lean on what you have seen yourself and, and you'll, you'll think that the world is flat. You will. There's, there's, there's no other explanation. The, because you see it education in the country I, so just correct you're seeing <laughs> you're seeing it from an ant's perspective rather than someone who is made it to low earth orbit multiple occasions actually has a a geocentric a, a, a geosynchronous orbited station sitting in orbit that can look down and see the sphere you know, you're you're ignoring all of that because you think it's bullshit, and you are just looking at what you can see with your own eyes. It's special effects. Somebody took a picture with a fisheye lens. That's it. Well, um, you no, that's well. actually true, dude. Um, the the, the fisheye lens effect is a thing. Yeah, so I say no, look well. at the look at the NASA live stream on YouTube. You get you, it's running all day, every day. And when they zoom out, you can actually see the curls um, of, at the end of the lenses. And the reason they do that is because they're pressurized. It's just, you know. Mm-hmm. Your face is a fish eye. But I'm not going to sit here and try to convince anybody that the world is flat unless we're just having an argument and nobody else wants to take that standpoint. But um, the world's a sphere, guys. It's, it's a fucking sphere. Put a uh, level on it. As it's much as, so yes, put a level on it. That shit's fucking hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> well, look at it this way. The only way anyone can see the curve with their own eyes is to go to the ocean. And not everyone has ever been there, okay? Because when you go to large lakes, I mean, I mean large fucking lakes... You can see Chicago from Canada across the lake, and according to the curvature of the Earth, that should not be possible. But you can see it. Why? Well, because the lake is fucking flat. Why? Because the lake is sitting on land. The ocean is not. Yeah, the ocean's just the ocean. It's just water. It's all water. It's called the pizza theory. Yes. Um, what's, uh... Oh, say the, the ocean sits on land, it's just really... What's the, the, oh, the pizza theory. Okay, yeah, I know what you're talking about. The crust is the, um, the Arctic wall. The ice wall, yes. Well, that was the other one I saw. The other one. I, I don't believe... I like, what crazy... It's like something the, from Superman. What you said. <coughs> I, I don't, I don't, I don't believe what you just said, uppercut. I, I don't. What did he just say? He said that the ocean is on ground. It's just really, really far down. But no, I, I think the ocean goes all the way through. I don't yeah, think that's it. I'm. I think it's. Um, I'm not gonna say that the ocean the is. Uh, mm -hmm. Core of the Earth be made of. You think there is a core? Because you do realize it could be liquid, like solid water you do realize that with that with that type of pressure the water will actually be solidified and turned to plasma the same as if it were rock you don't need iron to do that you don't need you don't yeah you you have no idea uh, what fucking holds this earth together have you ever seen a spool of hemp yarn there's theories well, yeah there's theories the but middle? yeah there's you have no there's one's dead no, to the center of the earth 
Correct. We know magma exists, okay? Nobody's yeah. disputing magma. that. However, magma is easily explained as... You ready? Compressed, liquefied through pressure, um, borderline plasma. It's not even iron. It's 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 rock. It's it's liquid rock. Right. And the same thing happens to water. If you take water and you compress it, it turns solid. It doesn't have to freeze to become solid. The pressure will turn it solid. If you don't believe that, go scuba diving pretty fucking deep. And once you get down deep enough, you'll realize the salinity difference and the pressure difference. There's actually an ocean of water beneath the ocean, and you can see it. You can see the ocean flapping up on the the shore under the ocean. It's a thing. Yeah, um, there's videos of it. You can see. Yeah, but seen, uh, deep videos where they have lakes of ultra so like high salinity water. Right, and that's just a salinity difference. That's not that's not done by pressure. Um, once you go down deep enough, the pressure of water will solidify. And then the friction of, we know what water is, because water heats up, but the friction of the high pressurized water will turn to plasma. We know this, we've done it here on Earth. We've done scientific so, experience, experiments where we turn water to plasma. We know we can do it. So you think when they map the bottom of the ocean, that we is have actually it. the water being sought with sonar, I mean, that, that, that is possible. No, there are several spots. There is plenty of ocean that we have never found oh. the bottom of. Yes, there, there is. Oh, I got, I got one and, in this. fact, there's a lot oh. more ocean that we have not found the bottom of more. than there is that we have. We have run cables from New York to England that lay on the bottom of the ocean. So you're saying they're just laying on a hard spot of water? We're not saying there's no ground on the bottom I'm not of the ocean. saying there's no ground. We're saying that it goes all the way through at some point. It's not just a complete solid layer. I don't think... I'm saying we're not on a rock. I'm saying we're it's on like a water a ball. Like a, right. <laughs> With rock in it. The North... Imagine this. It's wow, like that a was weird of yarn, looking. But, you know, with the hole through the middle. Imagine that. And it's just like the water What's goes the through the hole in the middle. I'm saying the water is not sitting on rock. The rock and the water are independent and permeate through each other. I just, I just, I don't think that the bottom of the ocean is actually just all the bottom. I, I think that it goes through at some point and that the world actually has a hole all the way through it is what I'm trying to say. You think the earth is hollow? I, no, I think it's full of water. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Wait a minute. But it's, but You're saying it's the earth is hollow? Don't plasma, make me hit you. Uh, I will water. come in it's there. Plasma. No, what I'm saying is water can turn to plasma just like rock can turn to, but it well, turn back in the core. The water after the plasma, though. Why I mean, wouldn't how it? Do, how do you well, really know plasma, that there that is has to be really actually... fucking hot. And it's Nobody not has you're separating water. oxygen and hydrogen when you're creating a plasma. In order to maintain your energy, you've got to burn one or the other. So you're either burning the hydrogen or you're burning the oxygen or you're burning both. Not in high pressure. Yeah, you have no idea what you're speaking of. You're You're speaking very ignorantly at this point. I don't know how to explain You're theorizing it. with no knowledge of how things work. But, no, there has to be a continuous energy. Uh, like there's no such thing as continuous energy. I That's impossible. Not, so there's no such thing as perpetual water. energy. Even though we think energy to be perpetual, and, and, and energy is never diminished, it, it just expands and, and changes shape, which is what we're thinking. That's also how we explain um, afterlife in some explanations is that we are energy and the energy just expands and goes out. Um, I, I, I understand that. However, there's no such thing as perpetual energy. We've seen that not, in the universe. I'm not saying perpetual. I'm saying in order to go from water to go from ice to water, you have to add energy to it. To go from water to steam, you have to add energy to it. To go from steam to a plasma, you have to have energy to it. So at some point you're losing energy because you can't just go simply go from plasma to water without there being a loss. Some loss. Once again, you, you have no idea what holds this earth together. You just assume. You, you assume that the earth is held together by gravity, right? Well, gravity holds everything together. Right. 
And and what is a gravimetric singularity? That is that is a form of gravimetric singularity. Um, a gravimetric singularity is a point of gravity that holds something else or pulls something else to it, which would mean, um, regardless of whether it's an actual black hole or just a, a singularity, there is a central point of force holding this Earth together, correct? Right. Yeah. Now, that being said, you assume that the rock is going to be pulled tighter than the water? I don't know. It's hard to fathom those pressures. Exactly my point. Because the water at that point would be solid. Everything at that type of pressure would be solid. Which is why when we look at all of the evidence of a black hole, because we've never seen one, um, we look at all the evidence of a black hole, we know it to be spherical. And even though we know it to be spherical, we know it to be a... a, a an, uh, we can't really say infinite mass because that defies physics as we know it. But a point of near infinite mass, even though uh, even though a black hole draws everything to it, there's nothing in it. Well, it's actually repelled around it and ejected. Is ice? I mean, if it's solid and it's not, it wouldn't be considered water anymore. You know, sure would. Water. Well, then it would be ice. Incorrect. That's if it's frozen. You can have solid water without ice. It's called pressure. You know what solid carbon is? It's called diamond. It's still carbon, though. The only difference is the pressure. It's what solid water called that's not frozen. Whatever you decide to make it when you uh, figure out how to add enough pressure to solidify water. When you can when you can create No, I did not. I said we have created plasma from water. Through intense pressure. However, we have absolutely no way of creating a pressure to mimic that of a singularity. We're trying and CERN. That's actually what we're trying to do. One of the things we're trying to do among about a dozen other things. But, I mean, we are trying to be able to create a singular point of gravity, but we can't yet. Does that mean we never will be? No. However, what I'm telling you is my theory is just as plausible as every other theory because there's no way of proving or disproving either theory. Yeah, they're both guesses. They're all guessing. They're, they're both a hypothesis. Could be a unicorn at the center table and everything I mean, according to some King James versions, uh, unicorns do exist, so... <laughs> he's not joking. Yeah, they talk about... No, no, I'm serious. He's right. They do talk about the unicorn horn. <laughs> uh, we actually have looked it up in the original uh, Greek... It's an Greek oxen. <laughs> it says oxen, where the, they put unicorn in the Bible, so... But, yeah. Which is not... Not trying to discredit anyone, or uh, I'm just trying to lighten the mood a little bit. But uh, my main point is, I'm not saying that the center of the Earth is not solid. Um, I'm saying that the composition of the center of the Earth doesn't have to be iron or rock. It doesn't have to be a mineral. It can be solid water. <laughs> go from solid ice to water gas without going through liquid phase two yeah you, yes you can it's all a matter of guessing to be completely 100% honest well no when it comes really when goes. we're talking about when we're talking about solid liquid and gas um like modified through water. temperature uh, we can actually test that. What we Nobody can't test is the transition between the three through pressure. We do know that you can turn gas to liquid via pressure, but we do not have the capabilities of turning liquid to solid because of pressure. At least not water. We know it's possible because of others. Joshua Oliver, thanks for the sub. I'm just saying, but 
there's no real no, that's way me, to know unless you Oh, are you is that you? Yeah, that's me. Well, it just now notified me that you are. <laughs> <laughs> Smokey! It's that was my other account. There's no way to know unless you actually go there and see it and, and realize what I believe it is this earth to be a water ball, not a molten metal ball. Yeah. It just makes sense that way. For me. Like, to me, that makes sense. So what do you think creates a magnetic field? I think a water creates a magnetic field? I honestly don't know how to put it to words of what I think it is. Okay, let, let me ask you this. Are, are, are you saying that you're under the impression that magnetism is only created by metal? Well, what else could it be created by? Water? You can create magnetism by water, yes, but... I know I can create it by wrapping a coal of wire around metal. That's metal, though. Not water. Have you tried... increasing the velocity of that water that is going around that coil and increasing its pressure? to the point of near solid and forcing the perpetual motion <laughs> no. No, I can't say that I have because it actually has been done in an experiment that's, that's, that's why I was asking if you'd read that one oh, I'm, not, I'm not saying you're wrong I just I, just, I don't know so magnetism it's more easily created by metal yes but it is not solely created by metal Frames is drive charging well, maybe magnetism um, in, in the sense of that definition probably is. Because let me look at the definition of magnetism. It might actually include metal in the definition. Probably the sense at which um, metals attract or repel each other would be the definition of magnetism. Electromagnetic force. Arising or caused by magnets. Yes, it actually has metal in the definition. So um, could we create a repelling or a attracting force with water? Yes. Could you create magnetism? Well, since magnetism cr has metal in the definition, uh, technically, no. No, you couldn't create magnetism with it. But you could create a repelling or an attractive force equal to magnetism. Because that actually has been done. And I hate to be the one to tell you this. It was Nikola Tesla. It was a long yeah. fucking time ago. Okay, you know that, you know, have you ever watched Nemo? That guy was fucking amazing. I don't know where the hell he got his knowledge from. He had to be sucking uh, the devil's dick the, or something. The lit, wow. Um, the, <laughs> you know the little fish? Have you ever seen Nemo, Smokey? Yeah. The fish trying to you know, find his son? Okay. You know the, the waterway that, like the river under the water, you know what I mean? We, we're well aware yeah. of the salinity difference. We all, we've all come Just to the, three. yeah. Well, I'm, say, I'm saying, like, I feel like there could be one of those going through the center of the world continuously, but at a much larger scale, way deep in the earth, and nobody knows it because nobody's been down that deep. You know what I mean? Like, that's the only way I can think to explain Maybe that's it. where the Megalodon lives. Yeah, he's, he's well, caught it's funny in the you mention there, that. It? It's funny you mention yeah. that because yeah. some religions yeah. actually believe um, what you call a megalodon, or some would call Leviathan, mm -hmm. or uh, mm -hmm. some believe dinosaurs to actually be aquatic creatures that were only brought up into the valleys between mountains during the Great Flood. And that's why we find them in the areas that we do. Um, but there are many that believe, uh, quote unquote, dragons to actually be uh, subaquatic creatures that probably do still live. We just don't have the capability to get deep enough which is quite funny we can make it to the fucking moon but we can't make it to the bottom of the ocean yeah <laughs> oh, pressures that, that's like the only way yeah I once we get once it. again we're talking about pressure <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> 
I don't know if that helps paint a picture of what I think is down there. The likelihood of that. The, the Not, sheer la lack of food down there. Usually, the deeper they go, the harder to, like, the, the further and further they see fish span apart. Actually, the, the deeper and deeper we go, the more life we find. It's it's not There's barren like we think it is. There. Yeah. There's every time, very every very time an advance, yeah, so I say every time there's an advancement in a technology that allows us to go five or six hundred meters deeper, we, we find, find more. we find more and more creatures we've never seen the or bar. even dreamed of. But yeah. Not, <laughs> but, but not in the density, not, not like in the density of closest to fish to fish to fish that you find in like a reef. Yeah, I mean it's. It, it, I can't explain it. I, I find I find the depths of our ocean one unexplored at, in this day and time when we've we've sent probes to fucking Mars, okay? But we still can't create a probe to survive the fucking depths of our own damn ocean. That's All insane. Right? The pressure is way too deep and, and hard. We know uh, how we know how to it. handle a vacuum. We do not <laughs> we do not know how to handle the pressures uh, of the depths of our ocean. So. We need transparent aluminum. I mean, that would be great. Spherical, because we know sphere to be the uh, most sturdy shape. Or if it was just to have no air in it at all and it could just operate right. without needing any type of pressure. Mm -hmm. But I d I electronics don't, I don't do real well in salt water. Um, no, we, actually, we actually have done a lot of experiments with... Um, replacing the air in the human body with a oxygenated liquid um, for the purposes of surviving incredible depths. The problem with this is um, most of them died of pneumonia because they were unable to completely vacate the lungs of the substance. Because, you know, we're not really designed to handle liquids in our lungs. It's funny. You, you actually you birth. actually start. No. Yeah, so, so you, well, you start, start for nine way. months. But there's been um, the there's been the theories that if a child never stops breathing the liquid, that maybe throughout the course of its growing would be able to actually continually breathe an oxygenated liquid but and be able to the explore the depths. The problem with that is where do you find enough oxygenated liquid to sustain human life for 20 for years? And how do you communicate with them? Right, because the vocal cords won't work. Yeah, how do you tell them? How do you teach them? How do you tell them, you know, well, teaching what would their be easy, purpose but... is? And how do you make them understand without... Do it, just <laughs> thinking about it, do it. Just find a level place to land. Um, they, I don't know if that guy helped you guys like kind of understand what I believe the center of the world looks like. What guy? Um, you know, but... What guy are we talking I, about? Are you talking to me? Yes, I'm talking to you. You're, you're the one that I'm responding to. I wasn't to. talking about a guy. I you said, I don't know if that well, guy helped you understand what I, don't I believe. I know if that helped you guys Okay, because that's not what you said. Is it? I, that's what no. I meant. Pacific. No, Pacific. you got to be more Pacific. You. <laughs> you got to be Pacific. Sorry. I guess uh, I thought one thing and said another, maybe. I don't know. But I hope that helps Happens you Happens all the time with you. Shut up. All the hope, time with you. <laughs> I hope it helps you guys understand my viewpoint on a possibility of the center of the world. Um, in my point of view. I'm not saying I'm right, I'm just saying that it's I think it's impossible. Call me crazy. I don't care. It's where the mermaids live, man. They live in the ocean beneath you. I say black holes actually fascinate me. I, I love reading about them and I love reading other people's theories and opinions of them. However, everyone thinks that a black hole draws everything around it in. However, everything that we observe actually says the contrary. Um, it brings it infinitely close to a certain point and then projects it outward. It's like a, it's like a, a magnetic field doesn't allow anything to actually enter it, but it doesn't like it pulls it, but it won't let it go in. You know, it starts I mean? at most most black Pulling holes that we've pulling. observed. It pulls from every angle and ejects from a single point. 
well, yeah. two single points, which would talk come again. You mean you're talking about the X-rays, or are you talking about the Hawking radiation? Also? No, we're talking about period matter. Um, what what black hole does with matter and light? Um, it attracts everything around it. However, it also repels everything around it. Black holes as we know them are observably spherical, um, but the best way to represent them and, and understand them is to see the spaghettification only occurs to a singular point at, before it is ejected, which is what you're referring to, the Hawking radiation. Well, once it goes through the event horizon, it's not coming out. But it, the but it never goes in. That's so the point. Pressurized, then it can fucking uh, explode into a gamma ray. Correct, Cersei. But it never actually, nothing ever actually enters a black hole. Unless she gives you permission. It's me. It's. Fucking <laughs> 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 perv. <laughs> I love our I conversations, man. We're talking about like nice scientific shit, and then he goes and <laughs> jacks it up with some weird sexual shit. It's like let's that's what we've observed, mood. Smokey. We've never actually seen anything enter a black hole, ever. We've yeah, seen no, we got, we we've seen theory. it completely obliterated and demolished and consumed, but we've never actually seen anything enter the black hole itself. The event horizon, or the actual spherical shape, um, the, def the, the defined shape of the black hole, has never been penetrated um, to, to date that we've observed. Which is interesting as fuck to me, because like I said, it attracts everything around it, but also repels it equally so. It, it attracts and repels simultaneously and equally. Which defies everything we know about physics, even though we know that every action, for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. But it, it still, it still defies physics as we understand it. Which is why there's so few theories regarding it, because we only try to define theories according to the laws of physics that we currently know. Because anyone that comes up with any theory that defies our laws of physics is uh, immediately disregarded as psychobabble bullshit because it defies the laws of physics as we know it. We would have to change the laws of physics to explain it and we're actually breaching that in the uh, astrological realm now because they have already accepted that multiple spaces that we've observed in space um, do not they are not governed by the laws of physics as we know them how does it go lean not on your own understanding what it's like, lean not on your own understanding oh yeah like okay that. you're talking scripture gotcha yeah it's like we don't fucking know all right yeah, we don't know yet. <laughs> yeah, so I say if you don't, if you just want to sit and theorize, we can sit and theorize all damn day yeah, yeah. and like, tomorrow and the next day. I'm I'm just here to live life because you know everybody's gonna die, so I'm just living my life until I die. The more we know, the more we fuck up. I know, right? Back then. I say we. Then. I'm referring to human species as a whole. Yeah. Way back when, when people didn't have any technology or anything like that, it was just about living and Why am I providing not for your hitting family. Neutrons and that here. was it. It's always now everybody is like. No. Because at one point, you know, some guy decided to stick a spade in the ground and start cultivating. That's not okay. I mean electronics, bro. Well, now we have uh, we have better share copying because of electronics. So now they got the GPS tractors that can stay straight, whereas if you move to miss one rock, they usually start getting these huge deviations in their, um... She thinks my tractor's sexy. I, I'm talking, like, before it technology It really turns her on. The world was better back then, in my personal opinion. It's always staring at me. I don't know, we were pretty stupid. When right I'm then. chugging along. Exactly. Ignorance <laughs> is bliss. Oh, not always. Yes, it is. 
She likes the way I look when I'm if tilling up the land. Like no, She's to. even kind of crazy guys? about my farmer's mm. tan. She's the only one that really understands what gets me. Yeah, life before tractors was a lot better. <laughs> it was slavery days, you dumb fuck. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what she just yeah. said. I said life before technology. You racist bastard. <laughs> tractors are technology. I mean, like, okay, you're you're, you're one of them like, racist assholes okay. that thinks the solution to our unemployment is the illegalization and revocation of the patent of the cotton gin, aren't you, you racist asshole? You're you're thinking you're you're not thinking back far enough. You're you're like old the the old western. I'm thinking like like way back, okay? Like fucking beginning of humanity. Like, I hit a girl over the head and take her home? Or y'all's, y'all's fucking, y'all's fucking racist perverts. Or I could tell her to stay home and shut up. <laughs> now I'm you're a mom. misogynistic I'm asshole. <laughs> I'm asking her at what point, because at every point, like, when the, the first person to use a, a, a oxen to plow the field rather than their own back, that was, that plow was technology at the time. No. Every, every step of no. our races. Look up the okay. Look up the definition of technology and tell me what it is, and then I will believe you if, if it's okay. Says, Let's look up it, the definition of technology. Any freaking type of electricity at all? No, I don't think technology has anything to do with electricity. No. Well, the technology, science, or craft. Whatever. But. The application of scientific knowledge A for practical purposes. Technology especially in industry. Machinery and equipment developed from application of scientific knowledge, the branch of knowledge dealing with engineering or applied sciences. So, I don't know if a horse pulled plow would fit Qualified. that particular definition of technology. I think the I industrialization really and the movement away from that would te would technically well, if, if you like, I'm going by um, technology fit the is some of techniques, skills, methods, and processes used in the production of goods or services, or in the accomplishment of objectives such as scientific investigation. Yeah, what fucking looking... definition are you looking at, Merriam-Webster? Oh, you're looking at Merriam-Webster. Yeah, what no, are you looking at? He's asking if that's what you are looking at. Because I don't, I don't see. Because I was reading Merriam-Webster. Um, let's look at the Oxford. Where's Oxford? <laughs> see, I always thought of technology as any advancement that for uh, advances our human race. So that would be like going no. from the hand plow to an oxen plow. Going from no, an oxen that, plow that to wouldn't be. Um, it's it's the application of scientific knowledge for practical purposes. And I don't think. So, just for example, like. Not, like I said, the advancement from a hand plow to a mechanical plow would be technology, yes. But I what don't think the the, the the changing from a hoe to a hand plow drawn by a horse, I don't think that would qualify as technology. I think that would just qualify as enlarging your current version, because that's all it is. Instead of doing it by your hand, you're letting a horse do it with you. All right, how about a wind, uh, water mill? Water mill is absolutely technology, yes. Because a water mill was not just used to um, draw water. It was not just used to um, mill, grain. mill grain. It wasn't only used to uh, provide um, a, a I won't say a state of perpetual motion, but water mills were actually um, some of the original um, forms of electricity. Um, through generators and whatnot, so and we still use hydroelectric power today. So I mean, I, I don't think even in its earliest stages you could qualify a water mill as not being uh, a technological advancement. Well, the best time in our history. Was before the water mill. That, I, that's about the earliest form of technology I can think of that would meet the definition. That you stated. Yeah, a water mill definitely would. Even a windmill, so, because most water mills had a windmill included. Oh, oh yeah, like the Dutch and everything like that. There's other places mm -hmm. that using water mills or windmills to pull water. Guarantee you, the invention, the inventors of those contraptions were never rich in their own lifetimes. So 
basically before we had the gear, life was good. For example, no, no, think about this because technically the invention of the wheel um, would be a technological advancement. Okay, so Laura says the best time in human history was before we had the wheel. Right? I'm gonna hurt everybody. <laughs> so I say, I'm pretty sure the, the invention of the wheel qualifies as technology, so. I hadn't even thought of that. Because that's, that's, um,. That's scientific knowledge. That is the practice of science and, and just, application because you have to, you have to shape the wheel and and some, some brilliant some bitch had to see a log through. rolling down a hill and be like, whoa, I got an idea. And, and, and put an axle through it. <laughs> oh no, no, the the it's wheel was me. around for several thousand years before anyone decided to put an axle through it. Did you, did you know and, that? Yeah, so, so I was saying the, the wheel, the, the original wheel, the wheel was wheel actually just axle, a milled, so, uh, was a oh milled tree or a milled log. So back when I would hit somebody over the head and take her back to my cave. And... Yes. Yeah, there you go. If that's that, a, that, if that's that was the best time in human history. history. On your unicycle, <laughs> of course. I don't, I don't think. Hold on, let's let's think about this for a second. Um, were we even human at that point, or were we still I cavemen? Heard. Were we? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck Had you. evolution <laughs> even Fuck made it yet? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you all. You guys suck. Well, we're just trying to get to see how pacific you are about this. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> like, all of you just go and jump. Let's, let's not forget the about the ancient Babylonian uh, societies that had cell phones and space travel. So, um, how far back okay. do we have to go for this? Okay. Listen. Back to the beginning. Back full, full circle. Yeah, there you go. Full circle. All I can say was if you wanted life without technology, you should have asked God that you be Eve rather than Eve be Eve. Oh, I wouldn't have minded that, probably. God, how, how minded that? How many kids would you have to pump out to start the human race? I'm, well, she think of it this way, years? because, I mean, as far back as we can think of in the Bible, I mean, the ark, had, is, a boat is technology, right? Uh, yeah. Stop it. Stop a hollowed it. out tree Stop is it. technology, so I mean. I'm coming in yeah. Fucking you. canoes. No, no canoes, man. I'm coming there and just fucking. You guys are just gonna hear a loud slap on the mic, real quick. Like. Oh, God, man. You guys suck. You guys pick on me. <laughs> what he said, like, like, well, before we had technology, okay, how, we're trying to find this? out how when that this? was. I yeah. hate fucking. Like, I how hate. How far back do we gotta electronics. go? Electronics. I hate electronics. I just. Oh. I do. Oh. Electronic, electronic technology. I hate okay. It. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's, that. a little, that's more specific. I hate it. All. Fuck you. <laughs> Learn how to talk, then come back to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> mm. So she doesn't have a cell phone. She does, and it's more technologically advanced than mine. And okay, she gets mad I when I mention I wanting a new one. Hated it. Yeah, that's because I know what you want. One. Yeah, I want one because none of the applications that I used to use on my phone work any fucking more. So mm -hmm. she gives you her phone, and you go buy her like um, what would work? Um, for electronics. So you couldn't even get her like um, Morse code. You have to give her like a homing pigeon. That would be cool. <laughs> Hell no. Let's get her a can with a string attached to it. Yes! <laughs> yes, Perfect. let's do it. Just think think about this motherfucker that was definitely on a gram ringing his bell. Uh, who was just sitting in a room one day and said, I wish I could talk to somebody who wasn't even here. I wish you could talk to somebody about using a can on the string. Yeah. The yeah. same back, spark back went through his brain. I'm gonna, great, I'm gonna tie, a, I'm gonna tie a piece of string to a can to carry the sound, kind of like that idiot tied a fucking string to a fucking key, so it'll carry a charge. So the best time in our history was when we had the Pony Express. That's it. Okay. I don't know what that is. <laughs> that would have been the 1820s. Sure, we'll go back there. Pony Express was that. when the uh, the post office was uh, horse. Oh, horse yeah. I would that, love that. That was your best way. That was your best way of communicating. 
So you got news. Hold on, like hold happened. on. She would love oh, that. And, We're the no, only no, place. Hold on. Ago. We're the only place to find a husband was in a whorehouse employed there until a guy came by that you liked. And no. Kai came and said, you got a pretty mouth. I'll take that one home. So where you got to fuck 15 to 20 guys before you finally find one that's willing to no, take you home. That's that's not. No, uh, she, no, no she'd be in a well-off okay family. She'd be a, a bio. A bio that's a bow. There's like no honor. No honor? But there was when you worked in a whorehouse. I was never <laughs> worked in a whorehouse, you fucking bitch. <laughs> oh, never. No. Never been a stripper. Never worked in a whorehouse. Uh, I've been a stripper. Not me. Th then be grateful you were born with all this technology. <laughs> I've been a f I've been a stripper. I, 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 I hate all of you. Made damn good money doing it too. I'd go back to doing it if somebody would hire me. Really, dear? What? I would. Hell yeah. You'd be uh, Rev's house of kids. Come here, get a kid. Oh my god. Because <laughs> Rev don't pull out. Rev sperm. Oh, Rev, ab Rev absolutely pulls out. Dick goes in, pulls out a kid. <laughs> exactly. Guys are ridiculous. Rev, Rev's house of loving. Come in and mm -hmm. get a bun in the oven. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, meanwhile, don't Smokey's know. already. <laughs> Smokey's already went to bed. And said these guys are fucking nuts. Nope, yeah. I'm here. <laughs> he's on Facebook right now, trying to find a better elite dangerous group to play with. So these guys are fucking nuts. <laughs> I love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> You guys are just uh, All right. I you will what? Huh? You said I will, and then you paused. You will what? I, I, I like, like I said, I would say that I like how the Amish live until I realized how stupid they are. Um, I kind of, like, like I want to make my own society that's kind of like the Amish, but don't have their beliefs. Whoa, whoa, pause it right there. What was that guy's community called in Waco? Oh. Um, I don't know. Drink, drink the happy punch? Was that, the, was that the Kool-Aid? They all drink cyanide. Was that the, the uh, was that, was that Waco? Because there were yes. two. I don't know if it was the Kool-Aid. No, the Kool-Aid one was in South Africa. I think. Yeah. In Waco, no, South America. I thought it was Friday South night. America, but. I thought it was South Africa. Oh, I, 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 did. I don't remember. One of those southern ones, but I know in Waco they gave out cyanide because they were talking about um, the smell when the FBI punched through. Yeah, I'm and pretty sure. Like, I'm pretty sure. Their... In fact, I am 100. percent I'm not even going to say 99 percent sure. I'm going to say 100% sure they didn't smell shit. They just said that they smelled it to justify their raid. No, I was saying like afterward when everybody was dead. Exactly. The only people that were around, allowed to be around there were the fucking ones that went in and cleaned everything up. Um, which is why I said I guarantee you that that did not end the way they said it ended. I'll be back. Hey, winners report the narrative. They probably Coming killed up. everyone with cyanide. Yeah, so, so I'm, I'm saying that the government went in and exterminated them. Damn hippies. I wouldn't... I wouldn't... I don't think those were hippies. They were just an extreme religious group. Maybe we'll do the same thing in Scientology one day. Doubtful. Scientology will probably be the one world religion. Oh, God, no. You don't think it's going to be Islam, do you? No. No, we like to drink too much. So do they. I honestly well, think it would be atheism. Um, I thought they couldn't sure. drink any fermented grape or grain. They're not supposed to eat half the shit they eat either. Oh, they love some bacon. Okay, this this jump is taking way too long. I think I'm going. To you getting discoed? Get, probably. Yeah. Oh man. I feel so excited I could just shit. What? <laughs> Talking about Waco, yes. Kakabobako. Kakabobako. 
Coca-Cola, Bob Coca. Okay, I'm saying that wrong. Coca Bubba Coke. Sounds like you're trying to say dirty words. Kaka, I love that name, man. Head. That is like a tongue twister. Yes, we're talking about Waco. Um, Waco, Texas. So I'm, I'm curious. Um, was that where they drank the Kool-Aid, or was no, that the one in South, South America Africa. or South Africa? One of the two. I think it was South, South America. Something. One. It starts with an A. In case you wonder why I'm flying into the locations, because I'm hitting the next button on Clash of Clans. I'm looking for a village to attack. <laughs> I'm incredibly hyper right now because I just in, like inhaled a freaking energy drink and it's starting to kick in. I know it's starting to kick in because I'm about to piss myself. Inhales energy okay. drink, okay. gonna piss myself. Oh my goodness. <sighs> More specifically, I'm gonna piss myself now. I just don't like how society is. So how what, do you? Is it like a homemade energy drink, or is this a name brand? No, this no, is a uh, this is Rockstar for the 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 fruit punch. I love it. The shit's great. I can't drink it. It tastes like fucking pure syrup. It's ugh. It's nasty. This is I gotta syrup? drink it. Yeah, syrup. I don't know. I just think it's too, it's too thick. It's just. Ugh. Gross. It's like one of those women who say she's thick, but she's really like 700 pounds overweight. Yeah, it's like gross. Alright, I'm done there. Just make 500,000 of each and 4,000 dark and spend. Let's see, how much did it cost for me to make that? Waka was the one Bill Clinton murdered. All religion is a cancer if you... Religion is only a cancer if you let it get too bad. Let it go. You can be completely that's what religious I, that's actually, and not That's actually what we were talking about, was the fact that um, I doubt very seriously um, Waco ended the way that the news told it. Yeah. Jim Jones yeah. in his America. Yes, that's what I thought. The Kool-Aid was Jim Jones, and that was down in Waco, right? waiting with bated breath for that confirmation or it always goes back. We're still waiting for you to say whether Jones or not Jim Town. Jones. Jonestown was the Kool-Aid. Venezuela. Venezuela, yes. That was South America. Yep. South America. So what was the method of, of death for the, the Waco? And, and Jim Jones was not Waco. Jim Jones was uh, Jonestown. Yeah, that's what uh, that's what the confusion is. I'm trying to remember which one's which. That's that's why I'm oh. asking questions here because right, so yeah, I'm trying Jones, to play Elite Jones Dangerous Jones. rather than Google shit. Yeah, the Branch oh. Davidians. Gotcha. So I'm I'm curious. Fire. Okay. I, I am curious. Um, you believe all religion to be cancer? Uh, expound on that. I, I would love to hear your opinion on it. I actually do a podcast on Twitch that, that is religious discussion, so I have no problem whatsoever with uh, turning this into a religious discussion because Wait. I'm just jumping, so. Wait, you said Jonestown was Branch Davidians? Yes. Or Waco was? No, Waco was no, Branch Davidians. No, Waco was the Branch Davidians. Okay. Jonestown was Jim Jones and the Kool Aid. Indeed. Right. I'm trusting you guys to be accurate on this because uh, I'm not. Now. Yeah, so, so I'm not going to. I'm take. not going to sit here and Google it real quick because I'm. I'm trying to stream and play a game. So I'm, I'm trusting you guys to give accurate information. <laughs> I remember the Branch Davidians had a lot to do with uh, excess weaponry. They were hoarding and stockpiling weapons. I do remember that. Is Reese still in the party, or did, is, uh, is he, he muted I watching a movie? I didn't see him. Any irrational belief systems? Um, I believe atheism to be irrational. 
So, uh, I assume um, by your definition, when you say any irrational belief system, then anything other than um, agnosticism? Isn't agnostic, they just don't know. Don't know, don't care, yeah. Yeah, okay. Just clarifying. I, I think... you can you can type more than four words at a time um unless if you're actually viewing this on PlayStation uh, the, the PlayStation live then I understand why and, and I'll be patient with you on that but if you um, if you have like YouTube on your phone or something you can you can type a giant paragraph and I'll read it out loud if you want to take the time to write it I'll read it out loud yeah. I, I will say that I know you can only write so much at a time on the, the PlayStation Live, though. Yeah. It depends on how far the PlayStation here. Religion. Okay, I got you. We'll wait for you. Go ahead and finish your thought. Then I'll read it all at once. Go some ahead, babe. People, some people are just... They go fucking crazy. And they behave like psychopaths. Like, those people take the shit too far. There is a way to be peaceful with everybody else and still have your own beliefs. Um, it's the crazy people that, that turn people away from religious beliefs that actually have good morals. And you call them crazy people. Um, I believe the term you're actually looking for is extremists. There you go. Thank you. Anyone, anyone that is an extremist on either side, whether it be religious or anti-religious, um, it's, it's theism or anti-theism, um, any extremist is irrational. Yes. Those people are. I'll take just... your time, bud. We're we're. I'm not going anywhere. I've got 53 jumps till my next checkpoint. That's not even where I'm going. So I'm. <laughs> yeah, we've got time. We've he got that but time, bro. Drink, so you're good. <laughs> so I just um, popped a a 20 ounce can of caffeine and sugar. So I'm good to go. Sparkling just... chemicals. But yes, the extremists are what turn people off. So... Or, or away, a prime example, say. my my wife um, experienced um, a Christian extremist uh, the other day. I she did. actually was trying to see if a woman was okay. Why? Because um, we live in Kentucky, and whether you guys know it or not, Kentucky are uh, we don't defund the police here. Um, we all about having the police up in your damn face in, in Kentucky. And yes, I'm saying that like that on purpose. <laughs> so. When we seen um, multiple police officers sitting outside someone's door with a government car in front of it, which looked to be probably a social worker, um, after the police had left, my wife goes down to, you know, try to offer condolences for what appeared to be probably a child removal. Yeah. Um, because we know there to be youth in that house. Now, that was not the case. That's not what happened. However, uh, my wife was able to sit down and have a discussion with this Christian extremist psychopath. Um, I mean, true psychopath. I, this is, I, hold on. I'm, I'm going to tell this from my perspective because I wasn't okay. there. I'm just going okay. by what she has told me. This woman says that you can only read the King James Version and any other version is is of the devil or or wrong or incorrect or doesn't say the right wow, thing. That is, that is um, and when when she was hey. offered an opportunity to read the actual scrolls in the original language that they were written, she Deeper. said that that was not acceptable, but that it had to be in the King James version. She now, I've encountered people like that. My, my extreme, take they... on that, my take on that is what fucking language was it written in originally? So you she... can't read it in the original language it was written in, but you're okay with reading a translation from a language that share words that don't even mean the same thing. A, a, a translation where you are forced to change at least a little bit of everything that is written in order for it to smoothly translate from one to the other. Hence the entire theology um, – I'm sorry, not theology the, – the entire theory behind Lost in Translation. 
You know what I'm saying? She literally told me that the King James Version was directly translated from Hebrew so we could under to make it to where we could understand it. So I offered her the ability to read it from Hebrew and she literally was like, oh no, it's got to be King James Version. It's got to be this Bible. And I was like, what? There's like Are you stupid or something? Like you literally James. just... Exactly. B because of – here's it. the kicker. Because of copyright laws, oh. every new publisher of a King James Version Bible has to change something, else they face copyright infringement. Where were we? 10%. Um, I think it's 10% is the actual like, – I don't know how much the percentage is, but I do know it's, 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 a, it's a good deal. It's, um, was, Waco was the one wow. Bill Clinton murdered. Uh, Kool-Aid was Jim Jones in South America. It's always – uh, bad Branch Davidians were the ones from Waco with the massive guns, stockpile of guns. Any irrational belief systems, religions are just some. In other words, uh, there are other irrational belief systems, which I'm with you there. No. So that's that's no. where you were. I just... Because I, I, I said that I believe uh, atheism Jake to be an uh, an irrational <laughs> belief system. So by yeah. your definition, I was curious whether or not you you believed anyone to be anything other than agnosticism or, or an agnostic belief system which is basically don't know don't care i i just waco I did know. nothing illegal yes i am well aware of that um that was that was literally a raid that was blown out of proportion and the narrative was pitched by the media to allow the feds to go in and exterminate yes we are well aware of that and no that's not um that's not a um, uh, what's the what's the words I'm looking for? You think agnostics are pussies? Why? Because they choose not to pick a side. <laughs> agnostics are just neutral people. Yeah, so I say agnostics don't know, don't care. Basically, you'll never see an agnostic starting a war. Yeah, <laughs> about what they like, believe oh, in. Well. <laughs> I just. Well, but by your definition, you just contradicted yourself because you said any irrational belief system. So, an irrational belief is by the view. Is is yeah. That 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 King James version lady, we see her as completely out of her mind and irrational. Yeah, complete she, completely she, psycho. She sees us as irrational. Which is funny because that woman and her behavior and her radical irrational beliefs are what the entire world thinks of. When someone says they're Christian. Yeah. Like, this lady was literally, when I got there, I didn't know that she told me about this. But when I got there, she was literally jumping up and down, dancing in her house, singing to God when I got there. And that's cool and all. But, like, when she's, like, she literally was so excited she could barely breathe telling me about how amazing God's love is and how amazing he is and how, how he teaches her and helps her get through and everything. This is just, this and is like, after they just took her kids from her? No, uh, she actually had someone attack What is her irrational about oh. atheism? Uh, it's not logical or reasonable is the definition of irrational. Atheists go against any logical thought and intentionally misportray any other view other than their own and completely disregard any provable fact that any other belief system other than their own states. Um, which means even if I were a Buddhist and I were able to explain to you how accepting um, a, a calmer chi and receiving or obtaining inner peace is better for your health, that is reasonable. Whether or not it has a damn thing to do with chi or not, it is reasonable to calm your spirit or your being, to calm your being, to um, ease your lifestyle. However, an atheist will say that because it's an organized religion, it doesn't make sense, it's ignorant, it's, it's uneducated. That's not reasonable, making it irrational. That is not true. Atheism does not mean that you don't believe in God. Um, look up the definition of atheism, and actually, atheism is a religion. In yeah, atheism is, an, is a religion of itself. It fits the definition, the definition of religion, of but religion. 
I believe, and a bunch of other people don't believe with me. We have religion. Uh, look up the definition of religion, and then um, the definition of atheism, um, and then you will understand that uh, a lot of people actually just misunderstand a lot of things, and they take things That's way out of proportion. Do, like way out of proportion people just go nuts it's ridiculous see see the the definition of atheism is the disbelief or lack of belief in the existence of god or gods which is a higher power um am i religious what's horseshit i think he said horseshit to uh the fact that atheism is a religion and it's do i believe in thor or zeus absolutely not However, I do believe... As a, as, as, a, as a former Greek, I find that irrational. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you would have shut up and let me finish. I do believe there What's to have door? been some, <clears throat> some type of... Uh, fucking peanuts. I do believe there to be some type of influence on mankind during that time to foster their belief in a higher power of which they named Thor or Zeus, yes. Uh, humanity has taken things away. I don't believe that man just invented gods to worship. Didn't no, I'm not, because I believe in God. I just don't believe in multiple gods or the Indian gods or the Hindu gods. I don't believe in the Greek gods or the Roman gods. I believe in a god. I believe in a higher power. But I don't believe in millions of them. So, I mean, you can say I'm an atheist because I don't believe in 400 million gods, but I would still be a theist in as much as I believe in a god. A, he's not an atheist, he's an atheist. Yes, I am <laughs> a theist, not an atheist. <laughs> you have to understand that there are, there That's are very certain specific. words... Oh, what are you doing? Why are you doing this to me? There are certain Quit words it. that have certain definitions that mean certain things. But people sit there and they think the definition of that word is one thing when it's actually another. How you have to look up the definition to a word to actually understand it. You can't just bumblefuck on and, and, and say this word means something when in fact it means the opposite. Uh, bumble, you have to educate yourself. You can't just sit there and believe what you hear. Oh... Which is what a lot of people do, and it's why the world is the way it is. Because you just believe are... in one less. Well, that does that mean you believe in three hundred ninety-nine million nine hundred ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine <laughs> gods? No, he believes in negative nine hundred ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. Or do you believe in a negative one god? Or do you believe in zero god? I mean, and if do you, you do? Not. Hold on. And here's here's the kicker. Zero. Okay. Here's the kicker. Do you know for a fact that there is no God, or do you just believe that there is no God because of a lack of evidence? Because if you believe there is no God because of a lack of evidence, you are still open to evidence to change your mind, which makes you an agnostic, a.k.a. you're a pussy. The evidence of absence is not the From absence of evidence. From your own definition. Because, or, yeah, from, from your own quote, you said that the... Oh no, I'm, ha I'm having fun. I I'm not offended at all. I, I, I enjoy a good debate. And we're not even so, getting to we're not even getting so, to the debate of whether or not a god exists. We're just we're 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 trying to define. We're tr still trying to settle on a definition. So you're, you're doing the Samuel Jackson approach. Which is you're the a pragmatist. Evidence. Okay. So by definition, evidence. a pragmatist would be agnostic, not atheist. You gotta understand, Fox reads words for what they mean. He literally knows the definition to the words, and if he doesn't know the definition to that word specifically, he will look it up and learn it. Um, so if you use a word incorrectly, uh, he will point that out to you, and he will correct you. Um, use the words how they're meant to be used uh, in a debate right. with Fox. By definition, because <laughs> I've, I've already stated this, but by definition, a person who is guided more by practical considerations than by ideals. A, by definition, a pragmatist is a pussy. <laughs> what is practical? Um, practically speaking and mathematically speaking, it is more likely, here you go, 
it is more mathematically likely and plausible for there to be an organic design than organized chaos. Because chaos is not organized. You aren't getting it either. Because a pragmatist is going to accept the truth that is more believable in practical sense. Now, but more believable in practical sense, mathematically speaking, it is more likely it is more probable and more likely that there is why the fuck did that do that? But that there is a higher power uh, creation and design rather than um, no power evolution random. I did answer the question. And to be to be completely honest, uh, anybody who tries to force... Why would I stop talking? It's my stream, buddy. <laughs> that's the dumbest thing you could have said. I mean, dumb. That's, that's very dumb. That's not, that's not even practical. It's not practical for me to stop talking or yield the floor to you on my stream. But by all means, I will commentate on what you are saying. Because at the very least, I have to read what you are saying. But if you're wanting me to afford you the floor, then you're going to have to hop on PlayStation and join the party. And the party is open. All night long. You're trying night. to elucidate the, the subject. Is that what you're trying to do? Or are you claiming that that's what I'm trying to do? Are y'all still arguing? He's having a debate with a viewer, Smokey. God. <laughs> Uh, to be completely honest, in in my opinion, uh, anyone who tries to force their beliefs on somebody else is the irrational and the erratic. My version. cup is too full. Absolutely not, buddy. My cup is empty as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I am a broke bitch. Oh, if you're yeah, if you're if thinking you... that my cup runneth over, I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, I am blessed. Um, in as much as I still breathe. Um, if you are going to join the party, all I ask is one. Yep, uh, join have this. Have mic etiquette. Allow yep. other people to talk. Don't talk over people. Don't try to take the floor completely and allow the debate to actually have to. Here we go. That is my PSN name. There are no spaces. I don't know why it breaks it up like that, but um, that's my PSN name. Me. My cup is running over and show me my channel. Show you your genitals. Stop why it. why would I show up. you? Why would I show you your genitalia? <laughs> I mean, you can show you look yourself. Genitalia. We don't need to help you. <laughs> Text is the wrong format. Yeah, by all means, join the party, well, man. Now we're gonna be back to the and share your voice asshole. because I don't, I don't want my stream to just hear me talking to a one-sided conversation. Yeah, make sure you share your voice for this debate. And like I said, um, don't be disrespectful. We can have a civil conversation without yes, going absolutely. crazy and psycho. Can we though? Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. Yes, Smokey. You just don't know what it. You just never experienced it before. Oh. God, this is so fun. I forgot how much fun it is to drive around in circles. Oh my gosh, Smokey. Are you. Are you, are you a Dabs Hope, bud? Still. Yes, yes, I am. <laughs> Um, Apologies to the rest through. of the stream. There will be a brief blue screen when he finally finds me and sends me a uh, friend's request so he can find the party. Yeah. Um, it won't last long, but there will well, be a brief blue screen. What were you guys screen. debating about? I heard about different gods. I was on the phone with my wife, uh, and I kind of overheard he's, some of it. He stated earlier, I'll go back in the conversation, he said all religion is a cancer. Um, there he is. Kakabaka to Bako. <laughs> there we go. Great yes. Conversation based off of that, and so he said text is the wrong way to talk about this. So he wants to join the party to share and his I'm voice. And I'm all for it. So I am all it. for it because I'm and not so trying to debate. convince or uh, what's the word I'm looking for. I'm not trying to convince or change anyone's view. I am just wanting to hear his view and offer my opinion on it. And yeah, unfortunately for everyone involved, uh, an opinion can't be wrong because it is a personal subjective point of view. 
uh, you can disagree Which with Which means his, his, his opinion can't be wrong either. It can suck, it's though. It's his opinion. Yeah. There he is. Yeah. Okay. Just, just educating everyone that uh, we are going to be talking a lot of opinions here and no opinion is wrong because an opinion is very subjective and personal to the individual so let's let's keep it civil uh please make sure you, your voice is shared and do a mic yes did you did you uh share your voice we hear you fine i hear okay. unmuting your voice is not shared uh, go into the party settings. Um, in the, like, go into the party. Go into the party settings, and um, you can either allow once just for the party you're currently yeah. in, or you can allow always. Uh, that is perfectly up to you. But it'll say something along the lines of like allow voice or something. Demons. Demons. Testing demons. Dude, would you guys shut the fuck up? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it is my opinion that I'm fucking hilarious. Uh, well, maybe even hilarious to look at. Yeah, but looks, are, looks aren't everything. But seriously. Oh, that, I agree with that. Yeah. But if your looks are funny, you got something. Okay, wrong. looks aren't everything. Yeah. That, was, ugly. that was Kakaboko. Am I saying that right, Kakaboko? Mm -hmm. Not as I am. It's oh. just like it's spelled. Coco Boboco. Oh, there's two B's in it. Okay. Instead of Kakaboko, it's Coco Boboco. Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, Extra I'm syllable. Just call, can I call you Bobo? I'm calling you Bobo. Uh, Coco is probably better. Coco would be better, yeah. But I would feel like I'm like talking about cereal. May I ask um, where you came up with that name? Because it's, it's very Close. unique. Uh, that was my niece. Uh, she was about three years old, and uh, that's what she called I love the that. Rock, rock next door. The dog's name was Pila, but it was a monster of a dog. It would, like, hop up on the chain link fence like a bird and stand on the fence and then jump out. The fence didn't mean anything to the dog. That's but cool. uh, I've, I've used that uh, gamer tag for years. She's like, she's a, she's a model now. <laughs> this is, like, years later. <laughs> it's still adorable. It's yeah, it's still adorable. Yeah, I love it. I start to say my my gamer tag, the one that you saw on uh, YouTube. Um, uh, it actually goes all the way back to the '80s of actual arcades. Um, back when we could only put three letters as our name, and occasionally, occasionally, if you were playing a new game, you got four letters. Yeah. Um, the three letters I always used were F O X Fox. Um, been known in the gaming community as Fox since 1986 and then later on in the early 90s when we could put four letters in the arcade it was chaos c-a-o-s so that's actually why chaotic is spelled without the h is because when we were able to combine them and actually have a handle uh, in the late 90s or mid 90s actually it became chaotic fox so i like yours i like yours as well we know yours is dirty, you sick bastard. <laughs> that's Cunt Puncher. Um, yeah. That's, that's yeah, his really. nickname. He's Cunt Puncher. He's Cunt Puncher. <laughs> Even though he's a virgin. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Immaculate Conception's firstborn. Yes. <laughs> we pick on each other. We have fun. Yeah. I got a question. Here, here's yeah. one for, and this one's this one's actually for Coco, um, because I already know the other three of you are just going to laugh um, and not be able to, to answer. But I think Coco can probably um, contain his mirth long enough to answer the question. No, I'm not saying you're immature, but I am. If a man is able to impregnate a woman without penetration, is that considered immaculate conception? No. That's just. I'm sorry. If there's no penetration, does does that count? Micro penis. <laughs> micro that, penis. That's no, a, I'm talking about know. back off, whack off, and throw rocks at it. You, you know gotta, what I'm talking you gotta, about. You, you gotta you gotta look at the first basement? word. The first word is immaculate. It's spotless. So there's no jizz involved in an immaculate mm. conception. 
Sorry, uterus. Your son was not. Immaculate means spotless. It was not conceived. I was raised Catholic. Oh, yeah. Trust me, when he was conceived, that was a lot of know my sperm's not clean. I clean my sperm daily. Now, you can have. What is it? Emparthogenesis? You can have emparthogenesis where there's no sperm required. Some species do that. Well, the actual definition of immaculate doesn't mean spotless. Uh, it means uh, perfectly clean, neat, or tidy, which would be the spotless you're referring to. But it also means, and this definition is equally uh, in age, it's free from flaws or mistakes, a.k.a. perfect. So, I mean, if you were to, from a distance, uh, just kind of shoot it and not hit the edges and just go hit nothing but net, that would be no, perfect, perfect, right? No. That's it. Uterus, <laughs> your kid was a test tube, baby. Hey, hey, my gym stock is still, okay. still holding up now. We still got a stuff there. So, so anyway, really okay, yes, anyway. all right. So Enough joking. Enough bed. joking. So that you were, you were, when you read my text, uh, the the comment I made about copper. Okay, so I read that uh, you said answer the copper question. I was like, I, I'm pretty sure I did. And what and. What, does, does copper, the element co copper, uh, conduct electricity? Does yes. it? Yes. That's what I'm asking. I mean, I'm pretty Great. sure that every welding lead I have ever used was full of copper wiring. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... It's and the definition of conductivity of is to allow... Um, to act Actually, easily. To easily allow the passage of electricity throughout. So, um, by definition... The answer to your question, as, as I answered, I guess you didn't catch it because we were talking about 30 other things. The answer to your question yeah, is yes. Yeah. Okay, so you're you're wrong because you haven't tested all, you don't know where, you haven't tested every piece of copper in the universe. You only really tested copper on Earth. So how do you know? Well, how do you know that there is copper uh, outside of the Earth? You didn't well, say aliens copper. Right? copper. You Hold didn't, on, no, 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 no. How do you know? One of these, I can answer uh, at length every one of your questions. Actually, copper you can't. You, you can't answer whether or not there is copper outside the earth because the only sure, way we sure have, uh, the, sure oh, no, can. no, you can't. Okay, all right, so. You're gonna talk about the emission of light and the, sure. ab the ability to, uh, to ascertain the elemental composition of an object based upon the light that it emits to the either visible spectrum either it's a mission emission spectrum which is what you're talking about there correct or an, or an absorption spectrum when correct. the light goes through it tracks out light right so you're saying that that does you're saying that that's uh, a, a fiction, a fantasy. I'm not saying it's fiction. I'm saying there's not enough information to derive that from what we have available. For example, because... There are libraries full of it. What are no, you talking about? No, Modern I'm not talking about that. I'm not talking about that. Listen, um, there's not about? enough information in the equation to derive that direct answer. For example, you can look at a light in space and you think that that light is emitting a certain color, okay? Um, even if it's a planetary body and it doesn't have its own light source, you don't know how many different light sources it's reflecting. You don't know the direction of travel. You don't know if uh, it is yes, stationary. You well, you know it's not stationary. <laughs> um, actually, no, you don't. You don't know the speed at which it's traveling. You don't know you the red do. shift to just, no, you don't. It is yes, all guessing. Do. No, you're no, all it's guessing. Not, it's not. It's not guessing. It's absolutely guessing. What, no, it is not guessing. When you have libraries of data, and you can you can discuss it and. Okay, who is more intelligent, you or? Um, what does that have to do with anyone? I'm 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 going to tell you if you just give me a second. I just got to remember the guy's name. Oh, black guy, astrophysicist. Neil deGrasse Tyson. Yes, you or Neil deGrasse Tyson. Mm -hmm. But we can I'm, triangulate I'm, from three different spots of where we are in our hold on. around the sun. I would, I would say Neil deGrasse Tyson's a lot Because he said it's guess. Those are That's his words that said it's a guess. Well, I'd have to read that. Uh, you don't have to read it. You can watch it. He said it on video. Yeah. Oh, was it that uh, Cosmos show? Because I, I, yes. Because oh, I love my show. Oh, fuck. It's, it's, it's one thing to say yes. 
like uh, math. You think uh, you think Trump's a billionaire? Do I think he is? It, yeah. In what sense? Do I believe that he controls one billion United States currency dollars, or do I think his net worth is in the billions as we speak? So are, are you yeah. asking yeah. a billionaire, yeah. and does he own yeah. that much currency, or does he have that much net worth? Yeah, Which that's one? whatever. Whatever. Then like yes, absolutely. I believe him to be a billionaire. Yes. With no evidence. With no evidence? Yeah. Sure. Why not? That's the problem. That's an irrational belief system. No, it because, isn't. It's an acceptance okay, you, of something no, that I can't no. disprove or prove. I don't have the ability to prove his net worth. It's an irrational. You, you know what rational means? I already <laughs> defined that to you on the stream. Did you? Do you not remember? We can rewind this and see what the definition of irrational no. was stated. No, that's your def. That's a stipulative definition. There are actual definitions of these words that you've been using. That yes, yes, yeah, and I read it. I read it out loud to you, based based on or in accordance with reason or logic. Now, logically speaking, if I am told by 300 other sources that a man is a billionaire, and by 150 of those reputable sources not being influenced by any direct influence of my own or anyone that would have anything to gain from the particular lie. But if I am told by that many people that the guy is a billionaire, then I can logically derive that he probably is. That's logic and that's rational by okay, definition. Are you, good, are you good at math? Absolutely. Okay, so if you start out with $400 million inherited and you lose money all the time, six different uh, bankruptcies and then everybody do you do you have his financial statements to look at because if you do you have more information than I do and even though we have a difference of opinion you believe him not to be and I believe him to be because you have more information to derive from then I would understand your logical deduction to be different than mine but with the information actually oh really I don't know what logic is we can sit here and debate reasoning and definitions all day and you're going to lose this well apparently because your argument style is to talk over the person don't give no, a chance no no it speak. isn't yeah no it isn't yeah it is that's all you've been reasoning doing conducted or assessed according to strict principles of validity logic is justifiable by reason okay i'm done i'm reading you the definition of logic yeah okay We'll see you later. Are you beta male? <laughs> beta! Ignor ignorant motherfucker thinks he knows. How am I ignorant when I'm reading you the definition of the words you tell me I don't know the definition you, of? You don't know ignorant what means you do not know. About. I don't ignorant know what I'm talking about. I am giving you, you the definition of the words you that you're claiming I don't know the definition of. You don't. You claim you know what you're talking about, but rather than explain your knowledge and where that knowledge comes from, you would just leave the party. Okay. Um, okay. To everyone, to everyone watching, um, leave a comment, like, subscribe. Uh, the conversation is now old, over. He has left. Uh, he gone. He no longer here. Um, no point in having the conversation. There is no opposition. Um, we're not going to sit here and have a one-sided conversation. Yeah. But then you just sound crazy. I do yeah. appreciate Coca Babaco. Uh, lovely name. Love that name. But I do appreciate him coming to speak. Um, give him 100% credit. I, I, I love the guy. He's very knowledgeable in his own mind, and I respect that. However, um, we were unable to reach a consensus so we'll we'll have this discussion another time hopefully if he didn't delete me um if he deleted me oh well but if he didn't yeah. maybe we can finish this conversation at another time so i discovered a water giant and ammonia world and like an ammonia based life gas giant all in one system I, well i got he was he was mad in at you for system, um yeah you're good that's all I have to say. Is he mad at you because you didn't agree with him that Trump wasn't a billionaire? 
Oh no, no. I, I even told him, I said, if you have, <laughs> if you have empirical data beyond what is uh, in my ability to observe and deduce my logic from, and you know him to be not a billionaire, where I believe him to be a billionaire based upon the logical deductions that I have available to me to deduce that logic from, um, then you know more than I do, and you would be in the right. However, that does not mean that my deduction, according to the knowledge that I have to pull from, is illogical. It doesn't it mean that it's – yeah, it just means that one person is more ignorant than the other one, meaning that someone has more information than the other one. And I gave him the opportunity to present that more information. But he decided to leave instead, so – the Dunning-Kruger effect. And to be co completely I thought you honest, said the text was the inappropriate format. To be completely honest, um, that was a completely irrelevant uh, regarding whether he is a billionaire or not. He joined the party for a religious discussion, um, well, not I think a discussion he was using that as an on example. the I pocket of uh, the president. <laughs> that was completely irrelevant. I think he was using it as a transition of... Uh... Yeah. Oh. The opening. Well, I mean, finish the conversation then, because <laughs> it means nothing when you don't. All right, let's let's read the Dunning Kruger effect of what she is trying to uh, probably ascertain the result of him leaving the conversation. In the field of psychology, the Dunning Kruger effect is a cognitive bias in which people with low ability at a task overestimate their ability. It is related to the cognitive bias of illusory superiority and comes from the inability of people to recognize their lack of ability. So I would absolutely agree with you that that is your problem um, because you, were, uh, you thought you had the ability to present your argument in the face of obvious adversity and when you were faced face to face with that adversity, you were unable. You ha you did not have the ability. You overestimated oh. your ability, and your illusory superiority came from your inability of yourself to recognize your lack of ability. Yes, you're absolutely 100% correct. I agree with you there. My ignorance is not equal to others' actual knowledge. Well, by definition, ignorance is the lack of knowledge. So if someone else has a knowledge that I do not have, then my ignorance is exactly equal mathematically to their actual knowledge. So I hate to be the bearer of bad news. You just made an ignorant statement. <laughs> Drop the mic. <laughs> Drop the mic at least. Any information of which you had that you could have presented to better educate me would have been my ignorance and your actual knowledge. Therefore, they would have been equal. Mm -hmm. But you choose not to give any information. You, you chose just to leave. We didn't even get into religion. And, and that was the whole point. Yeah. I, I don't know what logic... I gave you the definition of logic. I ask you simply, who was more intelligent? I didn't say smarter. I said, who was more intelligent? You or Neil deGrasse Tyson? You said Neil deGrasse Tyson. And I told you that Neil deGrasse Tyson said that what we were referring to was a guess. He said it's a guess. It's a basic estimation, an educated guess, a hypothesis, but it is a guess. A guess. Like, that's what I was saying, but my fucking that's, mic was muted. Was oh, sorry. Say that, that, those are the words of Neil deGrasse Tyson himself <laughs> on his own Cosmos show. So am oh, no. I going to sit here? and say that I am more intelligent than Neil deGrasse Tyson? No, I'm going to stand on the shoulders of those more intelligent than I and quote them until I know something different. So when a scientist tells me that something is a guess, I'm going to believe him that something is a guess. 
because logically all the information that I have to identify whether or not that scientist is telling me the truth about whether or not it is a guess also reveals from my own deductive logic that he is telling the truth that it is a guess. You are more than welcome to rejoin the party, man. I'm, nobody's mad at you. You are more than welcome to finish this conversation if you would like to have one. But you've already stated prior that text is the wrong format, and I'm going to have to agree with you. Unfortunately, you thought you were dealing with a Christian idiot, um, and you bit off more than you could chew. I understand. I've done that with atheists before. I thought I was dealing with a, an atheist idiot, and I bit off more than I could chew. This just was not one of those cases today. Rejoin the party, and we can see if it actually is one of those cases. But it, since it's 11.57, wait Three, three minutes, that way it'll be a new day. Every day is a new day. <laughs> hey, it's been a new day for an Unless hour. Unless you're on the East Coast, then you might have to wait an hour. No. <laughs> I'm, 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 it's already a new day. <laughs> or you're on the West Coast, you suck. Greetings from the future. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Greetings from the past. I'm in the future. Yeah, I'm greetings in the future. from the past, yes. <laughs> Damn it, I yeah. said it backwards. I said East Coast. No, West Coast, you would have to wait uh, two hours. West but. Side. Damn it! I'm saying it backwards. See, I have no, I have no faults whatsoever, or not faults. I definitely have plenty of faults. I have no um, words, predilections. No, no reservations about admitting when I'm wrong. If I know I am wrong, or I, I misrepresent something, uh, whether it be intentional or unintentional, I will absolutely admit to it and tell you. Oh, my subscribers went down by one. Apparently he, uh, apparently he got one. Oh, well, thanks for trying to have a conversation for the time that you tried to have bum, one. Bum, ba, dum. Absolutely. Bum, I absolutely bum, appreciate bum, the content. Bum, bum. Yeah. Bum, bum, bum. If anybody else watching would like to step in and try to have this conversation, um, uh, in your first... First, yeah, anybody else the pick up the other mic, you know, feel free to mic drop. No, I'm let sorry. us know and we'll have this conversation and it won't be, uh, won't be lost by the, uh, how do you call it, the, con the conceitance on the other side, I think it's called. Not sure. Does this mean we win something? Oh, damn it. I just bit my face. Who wins what? what? I didn't know we were competing for anything. Yeah, I didn't either, these. but since, Sounds since, like since we're down the, one. The, mm -hmm. other, the other end of the conversation is gone, so I demand I win, like, an ice cream sandwich. <coughs> it's a bit late to be having ice cream sandwiches. I know. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm telling you from the future, you can have that ice cream sandwich. <laughs> Thanks. Too bad I don't have any in the fucking fridge, and because of the stupid fake ass sickness they got going around, um, Walmart's closed. The only way that you could be in the future would be if time was measured based upon the rotation of the Earth rather than the concept of actual time progression. Uh, thus saying, you're you're in, you're in the now, bud, regardless of what time your clock says. Mitch, you already said it. Hello from the past. Don't <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Which is which is me uh, verbally admitting that that was actually inaccurate. Is a J O K E? Yeah. Bruh. Reb just People. has some retraction like they have in the paper. Yes, that was that was my <laughs> formal retraction, by the way. Or I could say something simply. Uh, we were memeing. Um, since since when is that even a fucking word, man? I hate that word. I thought, I thought, I thought a meme was something you looked at online. Fuck, I don't know. I don't, I don't. When someone says I'm memeing, apparently that means jesting, joshing, joking. Um, Wait, I thought that was trolling. That's, yeah, that's, no. 
Hey, chill, man. I was just trolling you. Oh, God. You're going to make me fucking define the damn word again, you dicks. Bunch well, of fucking you dicks. Doing? What, meme? Mm hmm. Are you saying because we're trolling you with our memes? Maybe. <laughs> An element of a culture or system of behavior that may be considered to be passed from one individual to another by non-genetic means, especially imitation. I thought that was miming. Fuck. Yeah, I thought that was that, 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 that is miming. Did you I think it? that's miming. -E 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 -E. No, it's M-E-M-E-M-E. -E -E -E. I think that's miming. <laughs> What's, is that an urban dictionary? I don't know, but... <laughs> Yo, I mimed her so hard. Lost ability to speak. An idea, behavior, or style, or usage that spreads from person to person within a culture. That hurt okay. Me. That sounds like COVID to me. <laughs> I was supposed to say so. An amusing or interesting item. Or yeah, a genre it. of items that is spread widely online, especially through social media. I think that's the definition we're actually looking for. Yeah, but, that's the one. Um, so I think the definition has probably recently changed, and the original definition that I'm reading makes no sense because we probably never heard the word until the current definition. So. I'm always said, "Hey, man, quit miming me." And somebody. I know, How right? Spell that M E M E. Oh, fantastic! <laughs> we have words now. <laughs> Oh, excuse me. Okay. I'm almost to Reese, I think, ish. I just got to the system and I was like, oh man, it's already been discovered. Oh, this is really pretty. And then I was like, wait a second. I that do need to go to the familiar. restaurant. Did you read no, another? Then, you discovered it. And then I realized it's discovered by Rev Chaotic Fox. <laughs> oh, you saw it on stream? Yeah, it was um, the striped looking lava planet in the rings. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I just got there. So. You just got there? That's sweet. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually go through and probe it because... Okay, I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to have to have a mic drop moment. And as much as if I don't have a mic drop moment, I'm probably going to piss on myself. So I'll be right back. Just go take a piss. I, took I am, but I'm going to put the mic down to do it. No I'm shit. Tell me what to do. Shut up, Smokey. You're not don't, helping this situation. Don't tell me they're going to piss myself. <laughs> I mean, my goodness, guys. When you gotta go piss, take a piss. It doesn't matter what you're talking about or any other That's people. That's what water bottles are for. Ew. Don't. I just Ew. spilled mine on me. I, I'm Ew. not gonna lie. If if I found a water bottle full of piss next to a couch or something, I would pour it on them. Well, that's what you don't leave it there you, when you're done gaming. No. That's Big disgusting. Enough. You get the fuck up, walk your ass to the bathroom, hey, and take a piss in the toilet. Your own We're both sanitary. gonna have piss no. on us if that happens, no. I promise you. Your own no. urine is sanitary. <laughs> that's, ew. Stop it. Just stop. <laughs> it is. You're done. You're done? <laughs> Just get your lazy ass up and go to the fucking bathroom. But I don't wanna... I don't give, give a fuck. That's disgusting. That's your ew. opinion. Yeah, that is damn right. That is damn right. It's my opinion. It is damn right. That's my fucking opinion. And you know what? You can like get a pipe and smoke it. I don't give no fucks. All right, I'm back, guys. I found him. Oh man, that's not cool, Coca Baca Baco. What? Did he delete you? No! He removed his thumbs up and added a thumbs down. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Not cool. But you can see who thumbs up you and down you? No. 
but um, there was a thumbs up. Unfortunately, <laughs> I'm going to have to claim that I logically deduced that. Yeah. Because of my foreknowledge of the definition of logic. Yes. Did you say that logically one. that your own urine is sanitary? Logically <laughs> that my urine is sanitary. Your own urine um, yourself is sanitary. <laughs> I would, I would logically like say that my own urine is sterile, sanitary. Sterile, I don't. Yeah, so I, say, I, I don't think well, I, I sanitary to, means sure. what you think it means. I don't think that word means what you think it means. I was about to say sterile. Uh, uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. We know that. We fucking know that one. Hey, I'll, let's, I'll have you know this. I never had to ride the short bus. I rode the minivan. Ooh, <laughs> step up in the world. Or is it down? Oh, super it's special. Down. That means you're super special. Yes, it does. I was All a right. specialist. Special. The, 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 specialist so the definition that would fit. Sanitary means hygienic and clean. So my urine, by definition, is it hygienic and clean? Beings how I believe the definition of sterile would be clean. I don't think it's hygienic. So beings how hygienic and clean is the definition of sanitary. Then no, my own urine would not be sanitary because it is clean but not hygienic. Sanitary. I love that song. That's actually one of my favorites. Hey, Amy. Why are you confused? Who's confused? You, me. Are you streaming? Just now, yeah. Oh! Well then. I just Hello there, there, fellas. <sighs> Welcome to the show. Yeah. Um, I went live because you said you want to stay up till three anyway, and three hours is a fine stream, so... Okay. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. Let me, let me open Twitch so I can... Lend you my support, and it's not even telling me that you're fucking online yet. You've probably been streaming for like eight minutes. No, I literally just went live. I, I don't. You mean Yumi beat me? Yes, you Yumi fucking beat suck. Me. You Yumi suck. Wins. Today, at least. Why are you irritated, irritated as fuck? Yumi? <laughs> were, were you listening to the conversation we were having? Is that why? Were you watching my stream? Because if you were. You was Hex. in the bathroom with him. What's up, G'day. babe? How you doing, Hex? Haven't seen you in three and a half days. I'm, I'm glad yeah, to know that you are still long. capable of joining a party, and you did not blow your fucking head off. Please yeah. lock your Thanks. guns in a safe and mail me the key. We appreciate this fact that you're alive. And Bitches turn your mic bonkers? up. Yeah, you're, I can't hear you. Hard you're really low. Oh, oh, nope, there you are. Oh, that's probably because it was away from my mouth. Yep, I agree. So what's up, uh, you know, just suffering in my sadness. Well, at least you're suffering in your sadness, and so no, you didn't let your sadness consume consume you to the point of non-existence. Um, well, so I, no offense, I sat but there I'm and glad. Thought about it. You sat there and thought about it. I sat there and thought about it. I had one in the chamber. Only one? You weren't very serious, were it, you? You could have missed. It's a bolt action, sir. <laughs> oh. <laughs> stop. Oh, stop. It's not cool. It's not cool at all. It's it. like it'll only fit one jackass. <laughs> right? I mean, Good the magazine Lordy. holds 10. I can have technically 11 in the thing. Well, you gotta but have I mean, at I'm least one, one more in the magazine. I'm not gonna be able to cycle that fucking bolt after I fucking Well, fire the just first in one case off, so. you are able to cycle that bolt and pull a second <laughs> trigger, you need to have it ready. Hell no, now, if I live three, that, then I'm a freak show for a circus. I started to say three. <laughs> having three oh. available might be, um. My ex was a charge nurse at a. A bit much, but I mean, having at least two available is definitely the way to go. Because you want to make sure you get the job done. The head. <laughs> I got 40 <laughs> rounds. You got 40 rounds. <laughs> Fully automatic just use weapon. A shotgun and close wait, your mouth wait. over the barrel. No, no, no. You, no, you got to use, you gotta use a, a Texas no, execution. Um, I gotta use a te what was it, it called? Make a mess. It bounces around. Bounces around. Oh, hold on. I've got to find the meme, guys. It, 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 it was... Okay. It's not a meme because it existed before the word meme changed its definition to what we know a meme to be. But there was a cartoon was a on like, then. right? It was a mime back then. I just I have one thing to say uh, to Hex in, in the regarding the uh, trigger pulling to the head thing. Um, 
Before you decide to like off yourself, please send me your awesome coins. Thanks. <laughs> 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 no. Yeah, in all in all fairness, over. guys. Yeah, in all fairness. Funny. In all fairness, there is nothing anymore. funny exactly. um about suicide. No one is condoning there is it. Um there no. is absolutely I mean, it's funny when a pedophile kills himself. That's or a clown. To, or to clown. you. This kid Betty goes everywhere. But Stop there it. is there is nothing <laughs> amusing or acceptable about suicide. Uh the caveat no. and the um I can't remember the fucking word for it right now, but I'll remember it next week. But one must one must uh, say for the record that if anyone is seriously considering suicide, do it. No, I'm sorry, don't do it. Um, if anyone is seriously considering suicide, there is help available. There are hotlines available. I do not have a link. I'm not going to be providing a link, but there um. is help available um, to help you make the appropriate decision on whether or not to blow your damn brains out or, or suck and down we are 30 not pills. Or the greatest support group to talk to about this. Actually, we could be. Oh, if you want to become our friends, if you want to talk to us, that's perfectly fine. I'm okay but with But yes, it, if, if anyone out there watching is having or has had in the recent uh, <laughs> history um, a desire or thoughts of a suicidal nature, uh, please seek help. Um, do not... Yeah. Do not be not fucking... or video it and send a link. Would you shut up, Smokey? Smokey. <laughs> Pig snort didn't happen. I'll do it on my Please oh seek my help before making that like decision, him. okay? You guys, we're trying to have a serious serious <sighs> comment here. We have two God. streams going. We cannot have Just pro streams. suicidal shit. Because I'm gonna stream. Oh no. god, he I said he's gonna do it on stream, and now he's fucking sitting here saying he's going live. Oh my god, I'm gonna blow my head wait, off. Wait, wait, send me a message. <laughs> I need, I need, I need to give you... Viewers for that. At I least need to give you my address, <laughs> so you can mail me those pennies, okay? So, but you gotta make pennies. sure... You Hex, you are not allowed... <laughs> Hex, you are not allowed to have a stream right now. Because I can't have you put up a sub goal, being like, 100 subs, and I'll pull the trigger. <laughs> I'm None of that shit, okay. <laughs> what would be the point of that? Right there. It's like, here, give me money, yeah, give me money so, so I can, can kill not myself. use it. <laughs> here, give well, me money. It's like I'll pull away. the trigger when I reach a million dollars. A million? Yeah, hell no. Right. It's like, <laughs> your average, no, it's your average funeral uh, usually grosses around $6,000. So my sub goal is to reach $6,000 payable to me, which is $12,000 sub goal to Twitch because you only get half of it. So once I reach enough to actually cover the funeral so that I'm not a burden or a hindrance to my family, uh, I'll pull the trigger. You know, yeah, you're you right. That. At that there point, at, at that point, are you trying to hire a hitman because you're raising <laughs> funds for you to do it yourself? So does I, that make you a hired gun? I'm just trying to get rich. <laughs> or die trying? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I just missed that. Uh, suicide is never the answer. Like yes, a gamer. yes, uh, never, really never. It's never. Um, never, never, never. I, I have literally considered it uh, before myself. I've never attempted, but I have considered it a lot in my life, and I've gone through so much. And um, the I considered I it, is, thought about it, attempted it successfully. Uh, successful. Uh, for a few seconds at a time, damnedest thing, heart kept coming back and going again. But I mean, you know, yes, I have attempted it in the past, but I am a survivor. Um, does that mean that once you um, get past that, that you no longer have those thoughts again? Absolutely not. I was walking no. across a bridge the other day and I had an uncontrollable urge just to run and jump. Why? Because it sounded like the absolute most fun thing in the universe to do at the time. But I was like, wait a minute, I wouldn't live. So I didn't do it. So. <laughs> Wait, I do that all the time, but it's usually because we there's water below. Right. Uh, who, who's Smokey going to play Elite Dangerous with? But I'm here. Send me a wing invite. Who's going to tell us that when we're wrong? <laughs> I'm just saying, um, to be completely honest. Hey, I'll tell you honest, when I'm wrong. If, I'm, if I'm not above telling you when I'm wrong. Life well, as long is, as you're Pacific um, about it. i got to be Pacific, hard. though. Shot in your Pacific, you <laughs> say the wrong fucking word. <laughs> Pacific, there's a fucking 
fucking mm. F's in front of the P. They've been doing oh. this to me hey, all night. Hey, hey, but what about, well, what about, what why about don't you pterodon? just continue in your or fucking explorating then, dumbass? <laughs> yeah, I, I fucking down. will. What about, what about a pterodon <laughs> or a knife? That's There's me. a cake. There's a P. Hitting it. What, about a gan what about a ganat? <laughs> oh yeah, ganat. <laughs> what about a kidnapping? Listen. A kidnapping? I don't think that works. Well, we found the Catholic priest. What? Can someone? <laughs> Ew. Father McFeely, is that Ew, you? Ew, bro. Stop it. That's just I have a question. Who thought okay. of using the compound word for kidnapping to to mean what it currently means? How does a kid taking? How does a sleeping child mean to like steal? I, I don't understand that. Fun. Because he's stealing all my nap time. I don't well, I'm sleep. trying to I'm trying to say kidnapping without using the actual word. That's that's why I was drawing a blank there. As I was like, e excommunicate? No. Um, ex <laughs> excavate? No, oh, not really. Like the worked on us when the kid takes a nap, so he's kid. I, I exactly. Would, I would understand if it was kidnapping. Uh, nabbing, maybe, maybe. But kidnapping? Kidnapping is like maybe okay, someone like retarded said kid, kidnapping, and it was some retarded redneck said, "Well, I right there with a kidnapping." And then maybe words I were mean, made. That that could be possible. Possibly, maybe. absolutely possible. Webster was in the bomb hole happy that day. Person you know? taking, yes. Um, to me personally, uh, if you think about it, um, it's harder to live life uh, than it is to kill yourself because suicide is yeah, the easy suicide, way out. Yeah, suicide. Suicide's a coward's way out. It's the easy way out and it's the pussy way out, man. You gotta Wait, live what, what, life what, what, what if you got, like, through this shit. Like, okay? reset life button. is pain. Know, there is the reset button. There's not a reset button, Smokey. You're been have, you, have you ever done it? Have you You've ever pushed it? <laughs> have you? <laughs> Push it real good. <laughs> Unfortunately, <laughs> I'm going to have to be the one to tell you guys, yes, I have tried it. And uh, no, there's no reset. Um, you either come back uh, exactly where you were or you don't come back at all. Um, there's <laughs> it's not a reset button. It doesn't work like that. Yeah, and to be completely honest, a lot of people try to commit suicide over the stupidest shit. Like, I have no offense to anyone who has tried to commit suicide over, like, a girlfriend leaving them or anything like that, but... Beyonce is... is four years. Beyonce okay. wouldn't date hey, me. Hey, I've done that. I've done that. I you left upset him Beyonce after four Beyonce. years. Beyonce. Being engaged to him, and I had two kids with the guy. He cheated on me, so I fucking left him, and guess what? He, he got the girl pregnant, they had a kid together, and then he held a gun to her face because she cheated on him with somebody else. I mean, Jesus Christ. I Tonight have lived on through that. And I'm with Fox lives. now. <laughs> I'm with Fox now. I've had four more kids. Life has moved on. I have got past it. Yeah, it fucking because sucks. Especially since kids? you're like, so. Shut up. And I'm not kidding about that. Um. Oh, seriously, geez. like. Not a conversation I mean, for stream. No, it oh. is not. Um, to, to seriously, I just thought they were really well behaved. About, no, I'm no, sure they are. are. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Um, to be completely honest, I have lived through a four-year engagement and and ended the relationship. Uh, he ended up cheating on me, and I left him. Uh, I don't know if that was the situation with you or opposite or whatever. No reason, like, I don't know the reasoning for, for the relationship to have ended, but I have gone through that. And we had two kids together. Um, and I str I have gone through hell after I've um, had four more kids and I'm married to someone now and I love him very much. <laughs> and I've been dealing with, you know, a lot, but I am still alive. And to be completely honest, you know, I need to stay alive at least until uh, certain people can come back into my life so I can tell them what really happened in a uh, situation that went down that they know they they don't know the truth. Pause. And we literally no. just said we weren't going to have this conversation and you are I having didn't the have conversation. This conversation. I was speaking relatively. I need to be alive for what's in the future and I'm not going to take my own life even though I would love to. Um, because of the possibility of things getting better later. It is not worth, like, I understand your Why fucking Why is the galaxy right divided? I understand, it fucking sucks.
But it does get better Obama later. Or Trump. And if and if it doesn't get better yeah. later, <laughs> then just you just gotta keep going. You just gotta keep fighting. You can't just give up I like that. I don't think You're it was Obama or Trump. I don't think they ever ran against each other, but. I don't, I don't think and that I'm not about either. to cry at all. I'm actually not. Michael, Trump always tears. blames Obama for everything. Yeah, I know. Fuck Obama. Well, He's you the guys, reason my I, I fuck political. <laughs> 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 fuck that Trump guy too. He's probably the reason my life. Why am I looking at me. this? Any Goodbye. PC gamer watching right now, let me Goodbye. know Goodbye. what the actual fuck is this. Does this happen on PC? Hold on. What, it's that's probably a penis. Fuck your wife? No, this. Well, no. Um, what are we talking I, about? Okay, no, he, go Look to at the stream. Team. Nobody fucking knows what we're talking Half about. Of the, okay, Half you know the how galaxy is gone. <gasps> What'd you do? Did you break it? You Look! You broke it. You broke the galaxy. God damn it, Fox. What the? Just Literally, nice legitimately. Things. Like. Are you on PC? No. No. <laughs> PCP? Okay, you know, you know how when you like go into the center <laughs> of the galaxy, all the stars are everywhere. Mm -hmm. Like they're really dense. Well, only half of it is really dense for him. The rest is like a couple of speckled stars throughout it. Like half the galaxy is. It's like he's getting background for star drop, and then it's really like, clustered fucked. Uh, have you guys seen the it's star cube? It's fucked on one half. Yes, I have seen the star cube. the other half, there's barely any. Like he broke it. He split the galaxy in half, and ninety percent of the stars on one side disappeared. Right. Now, now we one. Can't, no wonder we can't have nice things. The light I know. Hasn't reached this you is yet. why we have fucking uh, time issues. <sighs> I don't want to talk about it, you guys. You fucked with the spine taste. Spine. The, 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 the space time continuum, and this is what happens. I guess. He ruined it. Fucking broke the fucking galaxy. Fucked our entire universe. Oh. I fucked over the, the universe. Right, Fox. Fox, go to the right. Um, Fox, Yumi says good night. He's going to Back. bed. Night, bro. Yeah, I see that. Good night, Reese. I think his shit Bro. turned off. He's been gone a while. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Somewhere in life. Half the fucking galaxy's gone. This is dumb. <laughs> Nobody it. knows because half the galaxy's gone. I know. Yeah, no it makes way. it don't make no damn it's, sense. It's like, well, it looks it's like, like there's still a cubing effect, but they made it bigger, so they're getting yeah. better. Yeah. It's getting better. <laughs> oh, I went the Maybe the other half will eventually show up. So oh bad. wait, it's the other side now. Or did you turn around? I don't Flip know yet. I could have. I could have rolled. Turned around. I don't know. <laughs> but no, what Fox said earlier, we are not going to be any of this suicidal behavior. No, Please absolutely help. not. Um, um, we have a friend who has had those thoughts. We're trying to uh, let him know that he's not alone in the world, even though he's in fucking Canada and we're in Kentucky. Um, get a canoe. Get a canoe and come down here. <laughs> I don't think there's a path. He that. can carry it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to bring your panties. <laughs> what, what, what if he's sad because he doesn't have money and now you tell him to buy things? Why does he need exactly. panties? Exactly. You don't want to buy it? Just borrow it from somebody. Under eight dollars. You, you don't have to wear no panties. What if he no, wants to free ball it, man? Yes, I, always, I actually do free ball it. I don't own any underwear whatsoever. I like well, underwear. That is, that is a um, fucking scam to take money out of your wallet for nothing. That is not true. <laughs> that, Sharon, your opinion. <laughs> um, underwear, worn, underwear, underwear on a man right. serves the same purpose as a bra on a woman. That holds that shit up. My balls hang <laughs> my knees, okay, Fox? And you wonder well, why? Because be you friend. don't wear underwear. Oh, that's why. I know why. I don't care. Can you tie him in a nut? Can you tie him in a nut? I know exactly why. <laughs> don't love your children like a continental soldier. <laughs> First wife, go. Oh, God. Do they hit you in your butthole? Stop. Oh, my God. Stop. Is that a pulsar? <laughs> <laughs> you guys are fucking retarded. Because apparently they do for rep. <laughs> you guys are fucking retarded. <laughs> I love you people so much. You're so awesome. You guys make my life better, and I don't mean that as a joke or not serious. I'm serious. You guys oh, are... hell. Alright, let's see here. That is so annoying. I thought they fixed that by lowering the graphics whenever you got closer to the... Except for Smokey. He makes it worse. Why. No, I'm just kidding. 
Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and head up now. Even though you've had COVID. Since I have this neutron okay jump. Just... Now my boss's wife has COVID. Wait, COVID. Wait, oh, how the hell did she yeah. get it? Uh, she works with kids. I start to say oh, because your boss didn't you? get it. What the fuck, bro? What's she been yeah. doing with you? I may have it. I don't ask him. I don't think we want to ask that question, Uppercut. I, I don't, I I don't do. think I want to know what he's doing. Cunt, 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 cunt puncher, what the fuck are you talking about, cunt puncher? Uh, he's, was... he's probably talking about cunt punching. Um, <laughs> to yeah, be honest. All right, y'all, I'm going to bed. Night, Fox. Night, Lara. And everyone else in here. See you later, Yumi. Yeah, that was a while ago. He's probably already gone, but that's okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh. How about Three those jumps. Picks? You need to. You we took pennies out of inflation. I know you did. Ago. That's why I said you gotta keep them all. Like if you find any, you gotta keep them. Go metal detecting. Did they really take the They're gone. Gone. circulation? They're yes, in, and actually, in Canada, yes. Oh. To be uh, it was 2012, so it was the last year that Canadian. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Somebody oh, is one Canadian of my then. one of my friends is streaming. It's Billy Goats. I can't remember who the fuck that is, but he's streaming. That's me. That's him. Oh yeah. Okay. Hey, I'm on Billy Goats' <laughs> <to> stream. <laughs> who the hell is this? Who the hell asked us Billy Goats? Oh, hey. Listen, listen, listen. Um. 2012 was the last year that pennies were minted in Canada, and there has it's been Canada. rumor that 2020 is the last year Americans are going to have pennies minted, and they will force people that pay with cash to round up to the even five cents because they are getting rid of pennies. That has been yeah, said. It has been. Down. Yes, they'll round up or down. It's been a it's been a rumor. I've been reading about it for a good couple months now, and a lot of people are going crazy and buying. Uh, Here's a question. Boxes of pennies. Here is the question. In the Forever. event, since I, I want to ask this to the Canadian because it's already happened buy. there, who misses out? Does the consumer miss out when they round yeah, up, or up. does the, um, or, or does the it vendor can, it can fuck you. miss it, out? It depends on it's really a transaction to transaction base. It depends if they round up or round down for majority of the uh, transactions you do. Shouldn't cash, there be a you. shouldn't there be a standard basis of rounding down so that the vendor takes the damage rather than the consumer? Well, they gotta uh, if the it's, price, if it's three mean, cents or more, then they round up. If it's two cents or less, then they round down. So that's intentionally customer. that's intentionally fucking the customer, not the that's customer. Not how you it's round. not the customer's fault that the government Whoa. decided to take the fucking pennies out. Right round, baby, right round. What? They, these guys didn't go to the Holy school. shit! Ooh. Will it fit? Let's No, play. no, 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 no. That's not what I'm talking about. Let's see this. this. Watch this. Who's got the cucumber? Who's got the cucumber? Stop it. Well, that's We're pretty. not talking about cucumbers, you fucking <laughs> dummy. <laughs> Oh my goodness, Look at these wow. two big ass balls. Yeah. One of them's got a tail hanging off of it. That is so pretty. Right now, guys, he jumped out at a system that has two blue white stars next to a neutron star. It's very cool. It's really pretty. It's already um, been discovered before, but. Yeah, unfortunately. But that's okay. It's still pretty. Uh, speaking of which, this these look like they might be kind of heavy. This one specifically looks like it might be heavy. Eh, it's only two Earth masses. Two Earth masses and an orbital period of 76 days. I don't know. Let's fuel yeah. scoop and then we'll go around and uh, neutron hey. boost at the same you time. You guys want to hear something? I'll tell you something. So my cat decided she was going to play with uh, one of my balls of yarn, okay? This mm -hmm. morning at like 8 in the morning. Um, I was asleep. Of course, I hear uh, you know uh, fumbling around on the floor. I hear jumping and you know a bunch of a bunch of stuff. Ongoing ball. So it woke me up, and and around. I just looked in the hallway because that's where the sound was coming from. My cat was flopping on the floor. Shut up. My cat was flopping on Floppy the fucking balls. floor. Literally half in, her whole body was entangled in half the ball of yarn. Like she was completely just. Beautiful. The skein of yarn, okay? If you want me to just oust the word, I will. Uh, but no, she was literally encased in the entire skein of yarn, and I had to get it off of her. And, Look how and close that I, thing is to the other star, man. A ball. 
and she was tangled, tangled in the skein of yarn. Wow, that looks like it's going through it. Um, but yeah, I like I literally had to untie my cat from the skein of yarn, and then she looking. started chasing it when I tried to spool it up. And this was all at eight in the morning, so I woke up pretty early today. And um, now she's over here looking at me like, "Where's that yarn?" Why are you guys just, friends with such children? I'm just wondering. Because find, we love you. Because we love I'll you, Smokey. Your balls, we, my pretty. we love you guys. And your little yarns, <laughs> too. <laughs> I mean, I can I can be technical and, and just keep the word ball out of my mouth because y'all just can't. What? Like, why do you got balls, balls in her mouth? Y'all just can't hear the word ball. You Stick my you balls, the balls, the balls in words. your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Suck on my chocolate salty balls. Stick them in your stick mouth and suck them. Suck them. <laughs> you guys suck. <laughs> I love you people. Come on, everybody. Have you seen my balls? are big and salty and brown. What are you looking if you ever like need a quick for? pick me up, just put my balls in your mouth. Whoa. Whoa. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, that was the wrong button. Taking some pictures here, guys, in case you're wondering. Oh, well, of course. Oh, that, that one looks like she's got a bow in her hair. It's like exactly. a, a little star with a male star. It's so cute. They're going to mate and make a black hole. You don't know how close these are to each other. Watch this. I'm going to go through this and crash into the other star. Oh, it's going to throw you into the damn star, Corona, by being in that tail. Oh, God, he's going to die. Please don't die. No. No. Dude, look, look how close that shit is, man. That shit is <laughs> awesome. That's really pretty. Where's the other star? I can't find the Hex. other star. Hex. There it is. Yep. Do you still got a metal detector so you can find some Canadian pennies for me? I don't have a metal detector, no. Well, where'd it go? You used to have one. Anyway, that was interesting. That was a, that was a fun system, guys. That's now it. let's go to the one we're wanting to go to. Just just get a uh, just get a visa and, and come over. And we'll we'll go look at metal detectors together, <laughs> and we'll get you a canoe so you can get home. <laughs> I'm offended. You think all Canadians can use a canoe? Hey. What? <laughs> canoe? I just can't use a canoe to fucking get home. <laughs> Water war system doesn't it. work that way over here. You're not Don't trying hard it. enough. You're just making up excuses. Are you now. trying to yeah. Are you trying to say that you're too weak to uh, row yeah, upstream? Yes. Well, you can just walk the canoe hey. home. Hey, according the according to Looney Tunes, it's a thing. Yeah, well, yeah. it's not a cartoon, and this is reality. <laughs> Have you this. tried it? Have you tried it? No. Have you I tried? <laughs> hey, listen. I know I'd look stupid. Everybody knows you'd look stupid trying to do the <laughs> shit like that. There, I remember a dumb blonde hey, somebody joke. might see you and be like, wow, he's an innovator. You ever need a quick pick me <laughs> up? Just stick no, my balls in your mouth. Decided. They'd be like, look at that fucking idiot trying to row a fucking canoe. I remember a dumb blonde joke that involved <laughs> rowing oh a canoe God. in a cornfield. That's look at those like, okay. balls. See, now he's saying. Oh, don't balls. worry. You don't even turn into Jedediah or something. Okay. Oh, they're two different oh. colors. That's beautiful. Yeah, I was serious. Oh, There's that balls. was beautiful. That was a different difference in color. Oh, made why it are you making the color of the balls? Yeah. I'm not. Oh, everybody, have you seen my balls? Are big and salty and brown. What is going on? Wait, if your balls are brown, I, I got know. bad news for you, friend. They've been slapping that asshole too I'm much. Stuck on a box. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you trying to say that anyone with brown balls has no, shitty but balls? I'm in your case, you in racist your case, motherfucker. You, in your case, if your balls are brown, they've been slapping that ass too much. Uh -huh. How do you know? Do you know what color his skin is? Yes. He's... Shit. <laughs> are you saying he's got brown shitty balls? No. Um, I his ass. We already know the balls hit his asshole a lot. What you doing? Only, only when I sit down. I'm not gonna lie, um, he does sit on his own testicles and he racks himself sometimes. Racks himself? Yeah, I don't have that problem. Yeah, that racks himself. You, have... you, you put him in a rack when you play pool? Man. That's what it feels like, yeah. But he does do that sometimes. Rack him out, boy, right, let me get him out. Rack him, boys, <laughs> rack him. 
Mazer Rackham? Like yes, first? Mazer Rackham. Newton's Necropolis. I assume that is a fleet carrier. Apparently there's a fleet carrier here. Hello, kitten. Did you just Newton's say you Necropolis. Love or kittens. No, I said hello, kitten. I love oh. turtles. Got in my lap. Aw. Whoa, this is a signal. I have a cat. Awesome. She's staring at me weirdly from the floor. Stop, stop pushing buttons, uh, cat. I don't know. You're not, you're not giving your food attention. I, I don't I know. You. She's she just went into heat yesterday, so she's like. Oh, so you know, did you ever get your tabby? No, no, we still don't have a male tabby <sighs> to fuck her and give us kittens. No, we don't. Hey, hey somebody hey. fuck my cat. I know, right? Newton's cat. Just Necropolis. let me borrow your male cat for a Come couple fuck days. my cat. Make sure it has sex. Come with, on, guys. I just want to borrow his penis. Really? Wait a minute. You're what? Huh? Got testicles. What kind of I just want are to, you? I Sometimes want to, tabbies just need to get some loving. I just want to borrow somebody's male cat so he can fuck mine, okay? I well, want my cat to have, to have Why kittens. Why non testicles That is just weird. Well, if they don't have <laughs> testicles, they're not going to make kittens, you dumb fuck. But what if <sighs> they still want to fuck? I'm sorry. That's not the one I Test want. Cats without testicles need love, too. Cat. Okay, the cats without testicles can go run around outside and fuck random cats and not make babies. But what I want my cat to have, to have a baby. I like redheads, you know. <laughs> Listen, you fucking animal fucking bastard. I don't want to sit here and know your damn love life, you animal. Have you guys ever seen the Amish oil change? But, but my cat might have an for Amish what the oil hell? change. I'm afraid I am... to ask. Let's, let's hear it out. Let's, let's hear what... An Amish oil change is. I'm afraid of this. I don't think you want to know what an Amish oil change is. Go ahead, man. You brought it up. Fucking yeah, you. Jealous. You racist motherfucker. <laughs> Go ahead. Come on. Let's hear it. Yeah, well, you just gotta suck a uh, horse's cock until it fucking comes in your mouth and shoots out your fucking nostrils. How is that an oil change? That, that sounds, sounds illegal. Like it does. It does. <laughs> I need an adult. I need an adult. I'll agree. It sounds illegal. This is, this uh, my, is true. My brother-in-law sent me a video of this shit. It was uh, uh, disgusting. Nope. 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 Yeah, nope. It was really disgusting. Your yeah, brother-in-law sent you a picture of his shit. No. 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 Um. No, of a lady sucking a horse's cock. And it was, it was a... called the fucking Amish oil change. It was disgusting. Okay, it sounds disgusting. Know. Yeah. I mean, it really does. Well, I mean, I guess the horse ain't complaining. No. <laughs> <Ew>. <laughs> Bruh. Shut up. <laughs> you fucked up in your you head. Sir. <laughs> you, <laughs> sir. <laughs> you, sir. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, everyone who just joined, by the way. Um, <laughs> make yourself at home. Feel free. Well, you to... talk about everyone who just joined. Like, all of your viewers just fucking left. You had Probably. nine viewers, and we started talking about sucking horse cock, and then now you're down to five. They're like, "Fuck this!" Yeah, but then the it is too the damn like, hey, early for hey. this shit. I don't know what's wrong with the people in my party, but it has nothing to do with me. Right. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, guys. This is the moment we've all been waiting for for two days. I'm sorry, three days. I died the first day. We are going down. Are you to that planet? This ain't a good, this, that ain't a good transition after the whole horse thing. Uh, oh, <laughs> <he's>... <laughs> <laughs> We're you going down! It was fine until you brought it up. Come here, Nelly. Nessie. It was fine until you brought it up. You're fucking fired. You suck. I didn't stuck. bring it up! But I ran with it. just did! Oh, wait, give me a second. If you ever need a quick pick me up, just stick my balls in your mouth. I want something sweet. Put That's my salty. balls in your mouth. Just so happens, Chef's balls. Okay, I will reiterate <laughs> sweet. <laughs> Suck on yes, my chocolate salty ball. <laughs> You're saying salty, I want sweet. <laughs> How about savory? <laughs> Have a little savory too. Um, Listen, I'm pretty sure the lyric. I'm savory, pretty sure the lyrics sure. say savory and sweet. Whatever. I treat. want only sweet. I do not want savory included. Thank you very much. So no caviar. Too bad. 
I, I don't know. I've never had caviar and I don't plan on it either. It sounds disgusting. It's actually it's like, good. I mean, let me suck some some fish eggs out of Speaking fish. of which, let oh. me finish that sentence for you. Oh. Suck on my chocolate salty balls. <laughs> I don't know. I, I think I'll just have me a pretzel that's covered in white chocolate. Oh. Well, well, that's got salty. Speaking speaking of pretzels and chocolate. Yeah. Suck on my oh, chocolate please. salty ball. <laughs> Sorry. Go land on your damn heavy uh, planet. I'm, I'm scanning it as we speak. Stand by. Uh, that was right in my face. So, uh, yeah. The conversation's yeah. definitely interesting tonight. Just to let you know, I have been playing this game and I've been online for a long time. I just started my stream because it uh, is past midnight and it is no longer Sunday, so I can stream. Absolutely. So that, Absolutely. So that is why I'm live just now instead of prior. I'm sure you all would have loved the conversation prior, but uh. Too fucking sorry. bad. Too fucking bad, yeah, pretty much. Too fucking Hex. bad, yo. Heck, don't you know? Yep. I just want to let you know, I'm mad at you right now. Why? Because I sound like a fucking Kunik, and it's all your fault. How is it my fault? Oh, shit. Because you're in here, and I hear you, and it makes me talk like you. Ooh, there's, there's a biological. I'm getting. Here cold. we go. As a biological oh, and human. That is exactly what I want. What? There's a lollipop in here. Huh? <laughs> oh yes, I remember. Oh, I bought you a lollipop. Game. I got you. <laughs> lollipop, lollipop. It's so oh, lolly, lolly, lollipop. Oh, but 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 change. I'm dropping stuff. All right, guys. Here comes the 10.66 G F A off landing. Is my phone dying? Those were all certainly words, Fox. Okay. Yes, I'm they were words. Absolutely no fucking meaning to me, but they were certainly words. You don't you don't know what 10.66 G means? You don't know me. It means 10.6. Maybe I do. Maybe yeah. I don't. Who's who's to say, huh? I'm not saying anything. You're playing a space game, fucker! Are you streaming you Elite? Up. Are you streaming you Elite? Go ahead and fuck the whole hell on. Yes. Okay. Find me in your galaxy map. And know that a planet that has 10.66 times the gravity of Earth is about to be landed on by my ship. That can Watching jump 80 speed. light years. F.A. off. You don't want this. It's a lollipop kitty, and you don't want lollipops. I don't know why oh I'm going God. so damn slow, but um, my like intention is to go to that biological signal. Here we go. All right. Then. You're really close to that big ass planet. Yeah, I know, right? It is pretty fucking large, but. I might go get some munchies. You might. Ooh, you got you plenty getting? of time, apparently, because this descent seems to be taking for fucking ever. What you bringing me? Ba -doom, uh, boom, my boom, shattered boom. dreams. Aww, You're shattered. Oh, I will to exist. Look, I got a lollipop. I can't eat it though. I think I need to take a hammer to it or something because it won't break apart. Hey, Yumi's uh -oh. back. I don't know how you're about to eat this damn thing. It's so big. <laughs> Officially going to bed. All right, good night, bro. The ba -doom, the boom, boom, boom. Uh huh. All right, okay, here we the go. Piece of all of that. I bet you for you or Amish you could bite through it. My oh, spoon is too big. Bruh. I'm gonna taste cherry chocolate. You said you want a spoon? No, my spoon is too we big. We just met. Oh. <laughs> Go get the smaller spoon. My anus is bleeding. That sounds kind of personal. <laughs> it's a great name for a dog. I'm not gonna lie, guys. My, my palms are sweaty. My knee's weak. Did you do Arms one man, heavy. one job? There's, there's vomit sweater on my sweater already. already. Mom's, Mom's spaghetti. spaghetti. Yeah. Mom's spaghetti. 
supposed to lick this thing to death? It's so From big, it's going to take top. 10 years. How are you supposed to lick this thing to death? I will be right back, guys. Babe, turn off the camera. No. <laughs> Let's do a demonstration. <laughs> <laughs> uh, world problems. Get to the center. You're supposed to lick it, not bite it. Jesus Christ. What's he got to do with it? I don't know, but you should talk to him. I do quite regularly, especially when I'm in the gym, when I'm trying to do shit that I know I'm not strong enough to do. I just want to eat it. My God, please give me retard strength for a moment. Jesus Christ. There we go again. What's he got to do with it? All you gotta do is pick it up and go, oh, I'm special! <laughs> <laughs> like, I need retard strength. I need to be dumb enough to not know that I can't do this. Just never go full retard. Everybody knows you never go full retard. You realize he's actually catching backlash now because of that roll? You guys know what's funny is I fucking. If I throw my kid off, <laughs> it was I hilarious. Do blackface, exactly like Robert Downey Jr. doing blackface. This are perfect. I love this lollipop. It's a comedy. I mean, what? if they're gonna give a shit for that, then they need to just say something about white girls. Yes, but yeah. comedy is... White yeah. chicks, you know. White, white chicks, yes, yeah, sorry. Mm. Holy shit. I'm going up. I don't want to go up. Let's go down. Let's go down. Let's go, go down. Go down. Go, go. Quit biting. Uh, you're going down really fast. Nose down Not real as hard. as fast as you think. I want you to be 90 degrees to the planet's surface. No, no, oh, let's, yeah. the idea is to try to survive this, but... That mm. idea is overrated. Mm. Yeah, survival is... You have insurance. Yes, sir. Overrated. yes, sir, we have insurance. That's not the point, though. He's very, very far away. This is good. I finally got some chunks out of it. I don't think it should. Oh, God. I can't get the feast break that one worked. Can't tell how far it would go. 800k. I'm sorry, not 800k. I'm now 600 one. meters. Five, four. Fuck, I leveled off. Lost my descent. Now I've got to let off the fucking thrust. Damn it. I wonder what color is this going to change my tongue because it's rainbow? Oh yeah, that that was too much. Mm -hmm. mm. But it's breaking apart now. Fuck. Damn. That looked like I'd done that before. <laughs> Sorry for the anticlimactic ending there, guys. That's okay. Oh. Mm. Okay, so you're gonna get into a rover now and cruise Yep. 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 <laughs> I have to turn it on. Oh you turn God. me on, let's turn it up and turn this room into a sauna. One hot mama. Oh, now what do you say, babe? Do you want to? That's okay. That's okay. Now I'm surprised I didn't mama. take damage from being dropped from the nose of the anaconda. Um, where did the biological site go? Fuck me running. Whoop. That was a Is bigger piece than I wanted to buy off. That is absolutely fine. Fucking five kilometers away. I missed it by five fucking kilometers? Damn! <laughs> How did I miss it by five kilometers? This cell box just keeps singing. They're putting Yumi to sleep. He's trying to sleep, so it's perfect. Oh, okay. You want me to sing you to sleep, Yumi? Because most people... Mm -hmm. Uh, consider my singing uh, to die for, and, and I guess death is a form of sleep. Mm -hmm. Wow, the, I mean, the death traction sleep. on this planet is amazing. Oh. Woo! This is the way every planet should be. I say that till, whoop, till I hit a rock. Where, where, where'd it go? <laughs> Alright, here we go. Hmm. I can't 
stolen. Main oh, ship's power to save. Yeah, okay. Now I'm stuck in my piece, though. What that means is my um, FSD booster has been powered down because my ship is taken <laughs> off without me. But it doesn't need it. It's not going to jump out of the system. So I hope it doesn't blow up when it comes to come back down and pick me up. <laughs> that would be funny as Don't hell. Don't assist on. Just go straight down. Yeah. Just <laughs> 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 my face. Like, somebody come pick up my rover. I know, right? There's the biologicals. There we go. Hell yeah. Wait, you Hell see yeah. Biologicals out there outside the bubble? There's one biological here on this planet, and there's so no geologicals. There? I'm fixing to tell you, I'm not there yet. I'm still a oh. kilometer out. <laughs> I thought you were like, you're already. Fifth. Hey, Seth. Hi. How's it going? I'm trying to pick candy out my teeth because I I'm just looking on a at a something or other. I don't know what this is, and I can't, I can't target it to scan it. I guess I can just look at it. I can shoot it. It doesn't shoot back. It claims to be biological. I found space cactus. It looks like it. Wait, hold on. I want to go take a look at your stream now. Just try and stuff that up your butt. Maybe. Oh, well, that's it thing that's bigger than the SRV, man. Brave enough, you can. That's some giant space that's gas right there. there. That's how big ass ball. Are they eggs? I don't know. I don't know. I'm about to find out, though. Um, oh, it sound like polyporous a growth. Okay, let's see. What's this? Do I shoot that or do I scan it? Damn it, I can't tune in. I have to do this manually for what is it on YouTube? Chaotic, um, chaotic K Fox. K I T I T space F O S. No H and chaotic. What the fuck? I shot it. Zirconium. Who? <laughs> Pick me up. I put his balls in my mouth. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> so I guess it's a different. Flim excretion, a flim excretion. I'm going to go pick up some space biological snot. Yeah. Here we go. Uh, Let's scan it before we pick up the snot. Hey, hey, hey! Your secretions may be snot. Mine might not be. <laughs> Nickel. No, no, I need another beer. I would love with to have a beer party? with you there, bro. Yes, you but, uh, we oh, used all the beer in the Italian beef recipe. You've got a beer left. Do okay, I have a beer you. left? Love yeah, you do. Mm. How old is it? Jesus. What the f I ain't seen no glowing cactus. Ooh, tech like? medium. I love how the pieces fall straight to the ground, though. Where half the time when I'm doing SRV runs, the shit floats for about a minute and a half before it drops. The cat is meowing at me. I don't know. A Musidian seed pod. All right, let's go see what a Musidian seed pod is. Canadians would know all about it. Maybe. Before they do that maple syrup. Mercury. That's a that's some hellified maple syrup right there. Mercury. All right, here comes the phlegm excretion. Is it on the other side? Where is this snot bubble? Apparently, this this alien phlegm is technetium. Mm -hmm. You ever need a quick pick me up? Just put my balls in your mouth. Come again? What do I need technetium for? Engineering. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Ooh, 
but he's really quiet. I missed the last message please. in my stream chat. You uh, went to get a beer. I wanted to get a beer, and I wound up finding out that I have some whiskey. Lots. You've got mm -hmm. some whiskey. A little bit of whiskey. Good old friend, JP Weisers. At least it's not. It's not. At least it's not your arch enemy, Bud Weiser. That's the beer I'm drinking right now. You're drinking Budweiser? I thought you hated American beer. My mom brought over Budweiser a six pack for me. Oh, she did? She couldn't drink it, huh? Couldn't stomach it? No, she didn't know what I drank, so she just got me Bud. Thanks a lot, Mom! No. <laughs> it's beer, man. I'm not gonna complain. Tell her to bring you natural first, uh, natural next time. PBR! I only say that because natural is just bush. It's bush beer. It's cheaper bush beer. I'd rather drink OV. I mean, it's made by the same company. I mean, they taste different. I know, but, but I'd rather oh, fucking drink OV. All right, I, like I gotta pass out. I'll see you tomorrow. Like <laughs> All right, have a good right. day, dude. Uh, Night, what did you say? You're leaving. Good night. Yeah, I gotta go. I gotta Stop take my car to the shop at 7 a.m. Sweet. Yo. Nice to meet you, 7 a.m. Car shopper. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see what you did there, you may oh, <laughs> Dirt to dirt. Alright, let it go. Let it go. Oh, we like Cunt Puncher. Yeah, he's so hilarious. <laughs> he's a fucking barbar. Just like Smokey, but. I mean, no. with a name, with a name like uterus uppercut, you expect a different personality type? No. Not All right, guys, here we name. go. Yeah, his, his yes. name is uterus uppercut. Oh Jesus! What's he got to do with it? He made him. You know, for a non-religious atheist like yourself, you sure do mention Jesus a lot. Yeah, because Jesus saves his fucking roaches, dog. Um. Maybe. I mean, I, if you, I mean, if you're Jesus self, was a carpenter, and every fucking carpenter I know either drinks real heavily or smokes a lot of dope or does both. There it is. So you oh, can't tell me. You know. Sure, I can because uh, marijuana was discovered in the Americas, and Jesus was in the Middle East, and we didn't come to America until 1,500 years after Jesus's death. So, um. How do you just, know? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Were time. you there? Were Recorded you there? history. Did you see it? Recorded history. <laughs> Did you see it though, Fox? <laughs> Absolutely. Can you verify it with your own fucking, fucking eye? Fucking hands. Yes. Were you there to touch Jesus? Did you see it? Um, yes, I was asleep though, and I was in jail at the time. Well, then you weren't really fucking there. Yes, I was. I was really fucking there, and I touched him. Yes, exactly. This is That's the who we're talking I do about. Drugs, Fox. This no, I mean, I do drugs. this doesn't sound right. Like, yes, I was there. I was touching him. Yeah, I was that there. That sounds really dirty, Fox. Does not sound right. Were you molesting? <laughs> was I were molesting you Jesus? Jesus? Show us on his doll. Show me on the doll. <laughs> Watch how uh, we're supposed to land this thing. <laughs> I'm watching my ship says... land. In jail, touched by Jesus. Da, 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 da. I am a jail, uh, a jail. <laughs> what's it called? A, a jailhouse Jesus case? Is that what they call them, Smokey? Yeah. Yeah, yes. I my my so. conversion happened in jail. The difference is, I actually uh, didn't revert back to my uh, previous lifestyle as soon as I was out. Most do. I'm really yeah. thinking about it. Wow! Look Damn, how sexy really? that landing was, man. Why do I suck so bad? Mine didn't look that good. Oh. Because you weren't third person when you did it. It's tap time. Oh god. Was I'm is down, Jesus like, Jesus? Was is? Wait, I don't. Was Je was is huh? Jesus Jesus? That's what, what he said. Can wait, we? He's was asking if Jesus, Jesus was Jesus fucking Jesus, Jesus yeah. and that's why you converted because of the gay Mexican. I don't. I don't know. I'll, I'll have to need you to speak English. Oh, okay. So he's. I got you. He's. He's saying that Jesus was a somebody named Jesus, 
and you were touching some Mexican man. I mean, yeah. I'm not going to read between the lines. I'm going to ask that uh, better English be used. That's just an oh, assumption. God. Gay Mexican for the win. Okay, so yeah, that's what they, that's what. They gotcha, were, they gotcha. Were I did meet um, two gay Mexicans while I was in a federal uh, holding facility that housed ICE um, inmates. Um, those are people for the uh, Immigration Customs Enforcement um, that are being... Um, excommunicated from the country, which is called deported. Um, so yes, I did meet a couple uh, gay Mexicans while I was there. Um, both of them were quote unquote transsexual. Um, one was mid-op, meaning they had breasts but still had a penis. Uh, the other one was just a crossdresser. Did you but touch it? No, they had no. absolutely nothing to do with my conversion to. Um, Messianic Judaism. But they were there, yes, yes. I, I can't lie to you and say that they weren't there. And no, I did not touch them. However, um, they did offer to touch me, if that, if that's what you're wondering. I was talking about the bridge. Oh. No, no the, uh, the captain of the guard actually came and told me that uh, he was male. Um, he checked himself, and miraculously, six weeks later, he was out of a job for having checked himself. Oh, okay. That, that legit happened. But, so, we have successfully landed, Ice Ice Baby, right? <laughs> um, we have successfully landed on this 10.66G planet. Was not difficult at all. I'm tempted to have my modules um, shipped to whatchamacallie, uh, that place um, that I just came from. Explorer's Anchorage. Yes, oh. Explorer's Anchorage, and to try it with the other fit. Oh, Fucking hiccups. Think. I mean, how long did it take you to get there? From Explorer's From Explorer's Anchorage? Anchorage? I don't know, maybe an hour, hour and a half. That's not bad. Wasn't that bad. Um, I may... I don't know. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I'm, I'm not going to say yay or nay. I'm just going to say I haven't decided yet. What's your other fit? My other fit um, is one SRV, a size one Delta instead of a three Delta repair limpet. Um, a 1D lightweighted distributor with no boost and then 4D thrusters instead of the 5D. But in order to give myself a boost, I needed a bigger distributor and to fit the bigger distributor, I needed a 5D thruster. So I'm actually using a 5D thruster. Um, so yeah, it was fairly easy with this build. I am curious, but the, the build that blew up five times in two days, it was actually four times, four times in two weeks. Um, was would have been the difficult difficulty here i may actually uh whoa 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 what happened you mm. slow down i i may have almost just killed myself uh oh What's your percentage of? Forty-one percent. <gasps> oh shit! Mm. Uh, yeah, I would prepare oh, yourself okay. before going anywhere. What have we got? Like a eight-second delay or something? I just saw that happen. Whew! Landing's easy. Taking off now. It's questionable. Mm-hmm. Get my shields back. Do you have a repair limit? It's already attached. Okay. Shields are back. I don't know what happened there. I'm gonna have to uh, check. I I think I um I think I tried to go vertical and it didn't work. So, in case that was what happened, let's... Let's 
That might be too far up. Let's check another one. Uh, no. <laughs> Uppercut said, now maybe I'll be taken less seriously. You boosted, staring up, and came backwards. Yeah, I noticed that. I did boost pointing straight up, and it was like, nope. And I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> that should have worked. <laughs> I'll be back in a minute. Uh, it's really helpful right now. What's your problem? Um, I'm just playing for done. So, this is a game that's not Call of Duty. That's what you're mm. doing. Well, while you do what you're doing, I'm gonna eat some banana bread. Some banana bread? Is that what you said? Pep. Peppers. Oh. You had me a banana bread, but not There we go. Peppers. Right there. That's my oh, bitch. Is that is my bitch right there, fellas. You gonna get out? Maybe. We're gonna find out. Are you uh, with the newer thrusters this time, or? Yeah, this is with the the, the extreme. Th I mean, the 5D thrusters. But I would like to come back and see if I could do this with the 4D undersized thrusters. I don't I don't know what happened there. I boosted straight up and came backwards. That that doesn't make um, scientific sense, shall we say? I'm no person who knows physics, so yeah, that doesn't make sense whatsoever. We're going straight up in case you wondered right now. We're at 20 kilometers up. I'm probably not going to try to change directions until, um, until I know I can catch if I start falling. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to um, repair. that I have some more banana peppers. Can it? Alright, we're going to alter trajectory now by lowering the nose down to about five degrees. And we're going to, there we go. That's what I'm looking for right there. We're going to charge, oh, retract hard points. Mm. Need about five degrees. Would you finish limpid? Fuck. Do this one more time. I am one. Copy that. One more round of dab soap. There we go. In case none of you noticed, I was falling like a fucking yeah. stone when my hyperdrive jumped. Yeah. <laughs> that's why you had to get so high before Woo! you tried. Yes, that's why I had to get so high before I tried that. <laughs> had he done that closer, he would have, he would have plummeted. Uh, I have seen it happen before. I would have bounced uh, while it was in the animation to jump. I would have bounced and died. But... That is how you do it. Um, I would be curious to see if it's possible with the 4D thruster, and I do believe I probably will try that. Um, Knowing you, yeah, you'll try it. I guarantee you I'll try it while I'm out here. Why not? All righty. Well, let's see here. Yeah, really no reason not to. It's funny because... Um, 
I'm, <clears throat> I'm still probing that system. <laughs> That's why I don't probe this many things anymore. <laughs> so there's a station up there now? Out where? At Sad yes. Uh, toward, near Sad yes. Alright. Plummeted like a stone. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. I would like to, uh, let's see, where was that? Let's see, three hours, let's say 20 minutes? Around three hours, 20 minutes. Let's say two hours and 50 just to be safe. I'll alter it later. Alright. I'm gonna hop back for the night, guys. Have fun. I'll catch you some other Hopping. time. Later. Later, buddy. Thanks for stopping Later. by. Oh, yeah. Anytime. Mm. Yeah. They're stiff. You, uh, you done, Smokey? You going to bed? Mm. <sighs> Almost dead. Successful. I'm a 12% haul. So. I'm at 67%. I'm I'm actually repairing. <laughs> oh, I'll come out on my SRV. I'm gonna have to go back and and analyze what actually happened because I thrust it up, I lifted my nose and boosted and went straight down and just fucking bounced. I was like, what the I fuck? I think while you was lifting up your nose, you was already going down and then it was just too late to get that full boost, maybe? Maybe. I don't know. I'll have to double check that, but I was a little I careless. Yeah, so, so I was a little careless, so I have to be a little more conscientious of uh, <laughs> the goings on next time. Um, I'm going to look and see if there is a uh, deep space uh, support array carrier near here that I can ship um, my modules to to give it a whirl. Hmm. Let's see, beacon point, beacon point. Operational Galactic Center, the Abyss, Inner cool. Orion. Okay, the Veils, Outer Arm, the Abyss. Let me uh, launch this next repair limpet, and then I'll see. <laughs> All right, where are we? We're at Riker's Hope. Is there a Riker's Hope? Hawking's Gap. Riker's Hope. That is the Rick San uh, Friau de Blue Blue <laughs> Some of these fucking names they give these carriers. The Long Arf is its name. Alright, let's see here. H R O I. Blah. B L U A E. Blah. Yeah, blah. <laughs> <laughs> Q I T E three 
three, four, five, four. I said one more time. I've already done it three times. One oh more time. I what the fuck was taking you so long. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, man, not take me that. Three hundred light around. years. That's literally two jumps. If there's a neutron near me. Oh, it is two jumps. There is a neutron near me. I think I'm almost done with this system. I've got four you more. You found a carrier. Yeah, I found a carrier nearby. Um, one of the DSSA. Um, anyone who does not know how to find these, I will leave a link in the chat and description, not description, in the comments. Here we go. <clears throat> that is the Deep Space Support Array. These are players that have dedicated their money and time to... Um, placing fleet carriers within every sector of the galaxy for these very purposes that we are doing right now. It's for explorers to have somewhere to touch Take base. Refuge? Yeah, where previously we did not have this. It was not a thing. Yeah. So, giving them them fellers a shout out. Um, I think I will put it in the description. Stand by. I'll put it in all three. Um, so, is it kind of like they made their own like fleet carrier trail just for to help people out, or? Yes. Mm. That's nice of them. So you can't find this on Anara? Negative, not yet. You may be able to eventually. Well, how did you know one of these were close by you? I went on to a website that I'm leaving the link to. No, I'm on the website, but I'm looking. I'm trying to see how the hell you located it from your point. Oh, gotcha. Give me just a second, and I'll uh, I'll explain that to you. Save that to the description of the video, and then go back. Um, if you'll take a look at the stream, I'll zoom out. You noticed in the top center of hold on, you see, hold on. okay. I'm going back now. All right, now what was you saying? Um, you notice in the top center of my screen it says Riker's Hope. That is this geometric shape right here that I'm drawing out in the galaxy. This little spot. Wait, wait. There must be a delay because I do not. Yes, see there the is. Issue. Yeah. So this right here is Riker's Hope. So I took Riker's Hope. And I went to the website, which I can't show on my stream because I don't know how to do that. And I scrolled through all of the deployed um, carriers that are operational. And I found one that says Riker's Hope. There are two in Riker's Hope. Um, I okay, just picked the sector. first one. I got you. Yeah. Okay. It says destination region, and there are two here in Riker's Hope. Um, I don't know where the second one is. I guess I can look that up since I have it on screen. As soon as I find it, I, I, I'm retarded. Okay, here's the second one. Plow! <laughs> Z A dash A C sixteen. And there's another one right this is right on the line of Riker's Hope. It's barely in Riker's Hope. I mean it's yeah, that's four corners. They they literally put that in four corners. 
Um, but there's another one right there. It's six, still, still 6,000 away. So if I wanted to, I could fly from where I am to this one that is right here at four corners. But the nearest one to me, because I saw it first, is where I've just set my course. I don't remember why I'm going to it. You want to put uh, the ship, shipyard, uh, yes. ship modules? Yes, um, ship my modules to it and give it a whirl. Yep. Mizumono. I'm back. Welcome back. Oh, I was wondering where you went. I, I wanted to make I to get a sidetracked in inventory the rest of my food, so I know I'm not going to starve until Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm go. Yeah, I was right on the border of four fucking sectors. Yeah, that one's at four corners. That's why I called it that, but... Yeah, I can't see the fucking shit. Oh, there it goes. I just, like, turned it off somehow. Alrighty. Now, let's see if this damn fleet carrier is where it says it is. It's supposed to be in this system. Hopefully it is, and if it is, um, that will give the stream a uh, an example of how to use that when you're out exploring. Where there were once no, no shipyards out here, no anything out here, um, there is now an array of fleet carriers for explorers. Mate's exploration in the galaxy uh, no longer dangerous. Yeah. To an extent. I mean, you're still gonna blow up, but you ain't gonna lose mm -hmm. much. <laughs> well, if you I love the fact that he himself. uses he used a neutron system. That's amazing. Um, so yeah. you can literally get a good jump. H S R C limpets call. This is the whole seals. Commander Hull Seals. Okay. Sure. I don't know what HSRC stands for, but I assume it's Hull Seals something something. Reconnaissance commanders, maybe? Let's uh, research this. HSRC. Does not exist on PlayStation, so. Okay. Yes, this is not a. Notorious docking access allowed and docking access to all. So yeah, anyone can use it. Okay. Cool. Take a look at this beautiful nebula. Looks like I'm in some cotton candy here. I assume that's the neutron star in the middle of this causing all this mess. And regardless of how I feel about the fuel rats or the hull seals, um, the deep space support array is a revolutionary idea for this particular video game. That FDEV made possible by their release of fleet carriers. Finally. All right. I've said so much positive in such a short period of time I believe I'm gonna have to go uh, vomit now. <laughs> <laughs> oh man hi what is that look at that oh, I'm, I'm, I'm investigating what is this 
What is this? Baby, what is this thing? It has a ringed planet with some bodies around it. I Maybe see it. I see it. I am probing this system because I came across it and it is discovered by my husband. I'm putting my name on every planet. So <laughs> apparently she things. obviously has some uh, fantasies of uh, pegging a husband, which is never going to come to fruition. Excuse me? You heard me. What does that even mean? It means no. Don't ask. I am, oh, probing my hoe. <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? It I'm means so not confused. no, but hell no. I <laughs> That's not what I meant. I'm probing the system you discovered, you dork. You dork. Loki, I thought you were going to bed. What happened? Uh, I thought I was too. He thought he was too. He's got to be at work at like uh -huh. 11, so he's trying to stay up so he can sleep late. Yep. All right, one more time. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Look at that. Sound like a fucking attic. <laughs> Look at that. One more round of dabs. I want to complete as much as I can so I don't have to fucking come back here. Just stay there, and when you get back, you can do it again. Yeah. You don't leave. <laughs> what do you think of that, babe? That's beautiful. Wow. Bring all my ships to the nearest planet and engineer them as much as they can. <laughs> or near station. Thank you for visiting our carrier, Commander. We look forward to your custom. You look forward to my custom? What what does that even mean? Custom what? Exactly. But I guess that would be appropriate, being as how I am my customer. I want to eat this lollipop, but it don't want to break very well. Lollipop, lollipop, wally, lolly, lolly. Hmm. I got a piece. Who sings that? I have no idea, to be honest with you. So I decide, uh, since I don't know who sings it, I'll sing it myself. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's probably what, from the 60s? No idea, I'm not that old. I'm from the 80s. Yeah. I mean, I like Odie's. I like a lot of Odie's. I like Odie. Odie. Odie was not my favorite character from Garfield, but I do like Odie. I think Odie was a beta male. Normal was your typical female. I said Odie. I know but. what you said. You're like, this dick. <laughs> Why should I go with this? <laughs> Just roll with it. Just roll with it. <laughs> they see me rolling. <laughs> Day 10. <laughs> I like the paint yeah. job he chose for it. It looks like something realistic in deep space. You know, he, he went for the rugged look, much like I did. Mine looks like someone just hurried up and threw some paint on it to prevent it from rusting. It literally is what mine looks like, which is what I was I just, going for. I just realized my SRV has 1% hull left. Well, repair the damn thing before you lose it. Well, I mean, I got three more. No, oh, we'll let the thing blow up. Ah. Well, I'm gonna go put it up now. Watch it blow up. On the way? Yeah, clip something. <laughs> I'm gonna clip my ship. I love looking at other people's carriers to see what what dream they had in mind when when they were 
spending extra money to make it look however they allowed it to look. And no, I am not shaming people for spending extra money on the game. My carrier has a paint job, it has thrusters, and it has a body kit, so. <laughs> Negative. We're not, we're not shaming anyone. Good night. Good night, night bro. Yep, I'll did you blow up tomorrow. or did you actually dock? No, I made it. <laughs> night, bro. Good night. I'll see you guys. It'll be a little late tomorrow night, but I'll be off a little bit. <sighs> Alright, man, I'll see you on Clash of Clans in the middle of your work day. Yep. Well, maybe. I don't know how good of a signal I get at this plant, so we'll see. I can't remember. I don't think it's that great, but I might find a spot. Okay. Service tariff, 1%. Not bad, buddy. 1%. Boom, boom, boom. Here you go! Excuse me. <laughs> that just happened. That was funny. <laughs> Boom, boom, boom. This lollipop is like super good. Okay. I'm glad you enjoy it. It's really hard though. I can't even get a piece off hardly all. 4D thrusters. Mm -hmm. It's going to take um, 95 hours for it to get here. And it's going to cost me 120,000 credits. Mm-hmm. Hmm. means you have time to go to Beagle Point and back. Yeah, that's kind of the point. Yep. That's exactly Ow. the point. I just got stabbed in the face. Need a pack hound. I'm looking for three modules. Uh, frame just drive interdictor. That's not one of them. Um, a power plant. I don't think I changed my power plant. Don't need the prismatic. Where's mm -hmm. the 1D mm -hmm. power distributor? No. Okay. Damn it. I know I saved it. For a 1D power distributor, where did it go? Oh, there it is. 95 hours transfer, and I need a 2G um, FSD. Mm, I'm sorry, not an okay. FSD. I need a 2G planetary vehicle hangar. I have scanned it all. 2E, 1D, 2F. 4G, and I don't need that. I need the two. That's only like negative of candy. It's six to your teeth. If I suck in my teeth now. Do I not have one of these in storage? I thought I kept one in storage. Oh, ow. Boom, 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 boom. No, I do not have one in storage, which mm -hmm. means I will probably have to... Ship the ship instead? No, just uh, just land and take off just to see if I can do it with no SRV. Oh, yeah. Which is fine. I've already driven around on it. Okay. I got that system scanned. 38 jumps left to go. To my next waypoint. Wow, and this guy has a full. Seriously? Hmm. He doesn't carry SRVs, but he does carry 
The repair lab, it's, that's, that's amazing. Nice. Yep, that's amazing. Alright, my frame shift drive is supercharged, and we're gonna keep going. Um, let's see, does he have a shipyard? Did he do... Okay, no, he didn't. But he didn't sell ships, but he does sell modules. Heal, heal. Yeah, he does sell modules. Heal. Mhm. Mm <laughs> okay, he's got no. Let's see, hard points. Mining. Mm -hmm. Yes, he does. Um, he has everything here for you to build, turn your exploration ship into a mining ship. Oh, maybe he's like, hey, give me some fuel if you can. And fuel him, yeah. yeah. Or whatever. That's actually... Well, let's see what's in his commodities market. What does he have a, um, a purchase order for? Uh, tritium. Wow. He's, uh, he's getting it really cheap. That's actually really intelligent. And fish? You want people to sell fish here? Um, so um, long and thanks for all the fish, I assume. That's what you're going for there. Oh, um, yeah. <laughs> I tell you what, if they sell um, fish in Sag A, I will bring you some fucking fish, bro. Oh, that would be awesome. <laughs> if they f sell fish at Explorer's Anchorage, I will bring you some fish. I won't f bring you 1,500 fish, but I will no. bring you some fish. We'll bring you some. He'll be like, hey, someone gave me fish. And okay. Lara, that means you can, uh, when you're following my trail and you get here afterward. I um, can check Sajay, see if they have it. Yeah. Well, you can I stop by and see if they have it. Mm -hmm. um, fish. Fish. Fish, motherfucker. Are you searching on Inara? Laptop's something? being a little laggy. Oh, okay. 14 bodies. See if it's mine. It is mine, okay. So, now let's explore. Nothing super amazing in this system. So, let's just get it going. Let's go get it, get it. Asteroid belts, let's get them out of the way. <laughs> I actually might go mine this guy some tritium, to be honest with you. Just just because because he's gone out of his way to do yeah. this. I'm 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 to seriously go out of your way to give him some? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I might actually I'm, do that. I mean, I I have a decent I mean, does he have collector Olympic controller? You know what? You know what I'm going to do? What? I'm going to ship one of my ships out here just for mining because I don't use it anymore. Oh, and just mine for people out here? <laughs> well, I wouldn't say mine for people out here. It's just... Um, use it? <laughs> I'm going to use it here. And I'm going to go on about my business. But when I get back, yes, I'll come back here and I'll... Uh, I'll mine feeding. for him. Yeah, I'm gonna mi I'm gonna ship the baby rock biter out here. Oh. Baby rock biter. There we are. What's your jump range? 39. That's not bad. Um, how much do you haul? 64 tons. Do you have a fuel scoop? You do. Not much, but you do have one. So. Yeah. Let's let's do this. I, I like this. <laughs> It's gonna cost me thirty-nine and a half million to ship it out here. Well, till when? It'll Where be are you going? Worth it. Uh, my next waypoint. Uh, I'm, I'm Ninety-five hours, guys. Confirm. Yes. So I'm going to spend almost forty million to to mine for this guy. Why? Because I used his ship. And it was helpful to you. And it was helpful, yes. Yeah. He is currently at 52% fuel. Um, 
I mean, I could is he selling anything? Games. Does he have anything in stock that we can sell? No, he's not selling anything. So I'm just buying tritium. Buying tritium at rock bottom prices, which is fine. Can you it's absolutely uh, fine? Can you donate to the carrier? Like, yes, okay? yes. So, yeah. I was curious if I could buy it from him, but if he's buying tritium, he can't buy and sell it simultaneously. So. Ah, okay. So, in 95 hours, in case you guys don't know, that is uh, three days is 72. So, another, see, 96 hours is four days. In four days, my ship will get here, which means I've got four days get to of exploration <laughs> to Beagle Point, mm -hmm. which is my next stop, mind you. I may go up here. Hey, that would give me enough time to catch up. <laughs> yeah. Um, I shared... I'm going to bookmark this guy's carrier. Ooh, we got a water world. Is that an ammonia world or is that a water world? And then share it with the... Very close. Share it with the squadron. This system is undiscovered, so it will be mine. I feel like the blue bow is getting old on my headset. Think so? Yeah, I think I need to make something new. Change it up a bit. But I, I honestly did... I thought about that when I made this bow. Um... I thought it might, I might want to change it out later. So it's actually removable. I might just make one of a different color. You know? I got two water worlds. Alright. You know, it would be really cool, FDev, mm -hmm. just letting you know. Oh. It would be really cool, FDev, if a carrier owner could see who was on their carrier. Cool. It would make them a lot more. Where did call sign go? There we go. I could have sworn he was still in the party. I'm going to find a way to share that with, uh, with the site. But I may actually use that as a thumbnail. I don't know how. I will figure it out. Um, I don't know. Maybe... <sighs> Uh, yeah, I have no idea. The fucking hiccups. I find it interesting that the hull seals have a carrier this close to the highest known G landable in the game. In other words, they expect you to, if you survive, uh, give them a call. <laughs> <laughs> I have an idea. 
idea. What's that? Take a screenshot of the one that you want to be a thumbnail. Send it to me on the pl on PlayStation Network on this account. I'll screenshot it and I'll email it to you. And then you can open the email on the laptop, save it to the laptop, and then upload the image as a thumbnail to your YouTube channel. From the computer. Paint's down to 49%. All right, I'll do that. And as far as Universal Carta Graphics goes, I literally just buckyballed it here. So um, I really almost want to go and mine for this guy. Uh, I thought your mining ship was like gone <laughs> for your four days. It is, but that's not the point. I, I, I oh. literally want to hot rig my ship because he has the equipment to do so. Is there an SRV on this little thing? Is there an SRV on it? Maybe. Of course not. Of course not. <laughs> but. Oh well. What would I have to do? I started making muffins. Oh, I found muffins! Them. I knew you went somewhere. Blueberry chocolate chip. Bitches. Didn't listen. Oh, because I wasn't at my PlayStation. Yeah, I moved everything that... into my room, so I don't see anything from my kitchen now. I live in my room like a hermit. I need to replace my mattress. What'd you do, burn it? No. I just... It hurts to sleep on it. Ow. Not in like a physical sense, but, you know. Ow. I get you. I understand. Yeah. Uh, I now have 19 or 18 minutes to kill before my muffins are done. Muffins, huh? Get a money. Muffins! Jump out the box. Muffin, Blueberry muffin. Blueberry chocolate chip. The sound is pretty good. They're delicious. I make them from scratch. Mining lasers. I am a mining laser. Dear lord, is this yeah, even gonna a, work? Get a mining ship and jump out the fox and help him mine tritium for this guy. <sighs> but I'm drifting through space. Drifting away. This is the quest to end all quests. How far can I go on a full tank just endlessly drifting through space? Um, it's easy to figure that out. Shh, we're just we're just gonna experience it, okay? I don't need the fucking hard numbers from you, Fox. Okay, all right. I'm sorry. It's, it's pretty simple to figure it out, but I mean, <laughs> I'm here for the experience, not the math. All right. All right, all right. Just saying. <laughs> I can help you figure it out. <laughs> I'll figure it out. Like, One shut up, damn it! I don't want to know. <laughs> One light second at a time. Tell you what, before I get offline and before I alter my whoa, so select a fire group. Oh shit! What the fuck did I change? <laughs> oh man. Oh okay, I got you. Yeah. Before you get off stream and in your edit your ship. Hmm. I think I'm going to go and see if there's anywhere to actually mine tritium in this system. I'll see if you just put it nearby. Yeah. Because he is parked right next to a ring, so I'm curious. I might do oh, a little yeah. mining while I'm out here. Why? Because I have nothing better to do. Landing plan is engaged. Restrict speed until clear of Arteria.
Are you gonna crash into this damn ring? Like, for real? Are you gonna do this to me? When are my muffins done? When are they gonna be mailed to me? Need to know this. Wow, that's creepy how close this thing is flying to those rings. Wow. It's pretty. It is. Um, is there an inner ring? I can't tell. I'll check. Let's see here. I'm moving too fast. <laughs> I don't see any yellow, though. It's a gorgeous place to mine. It looks all psychedelic and shit. Where did call sign go? He's gonna burn the muffins. I'm not burning the muffins. It's only been like two minutes. Damn, chill out, woman. Listen. <laughs> Don't you tell me how to cook my muffins. Those muffins I are know important. I how to cook my own fucking muffins, already. Right? Do you know the Muffin Man? Yeah, he the lives down Drew Lane. The oh, Muffin oh, Man! man. <laughs> yeah, he lives down Drew Lane. Mm. This is really? Really? He's so beautiful. <laughs> no, don't fly into the light. I can't help it. It's so beautiful. No. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Sorry. A reenactment of a bug's life. Yeah, so this is actually a really beautiful place to mine, guys. Is it actually Heptardium? I don't know yet. Oh, okay. I'm waiting for my ship to slow the fuck down so I can hit the ring. Oh, too fast. To yeah. I already hit it once, but apparently it's sped up. Now it's too fast. Oh. There we go. Complete. Is there a tritium hotspot? We've got platinum, monazite, rod plunzite, painite, syrindabite. The answer is no. Mm. Are there so, any other ring uh, planets in that system? I don't know. I didn't fucking check. Oh. Well, if it's already been discovered by somebody, it should just show up in the system map if you found the one. It doesn't work like that. That only works for things within 5,000 light seconds. Okay. I assure you, uh, that is correct, babe. Okay. The entire system does not always show up if it's already been discovered. I've displayed that about a dozen times on yeah, this stream I alone. the opposite. Let's see it then. Right. All Let's right, see it. Right. I, I'm I'm blowing my horn right now. It says there's five things in this system right now. Yep. There's five things in the map. Okay. How close is the furthest one? I don't know. That has no Select it. Yes, it does. It says four thousand five hundred and ninety-nine. Exactly. It's less than five thousand light seconds, as I said. So then, why did I get? Your find a direct one. find a direct was. because you were in wing with me find a direct fucking uh example that's more than 5000 light seconds and we're not referring to stars i, I had to fly 135000 light seconds out to probe the last fucking planet from the system that was yours and i didn't do the fucking stupid scanner i just blew the horn saw it was discovered and started probing it cuz i saw it was you you're pissing me off. Wow, there's a lot of rings in that system. What system? The one you're in. Surely there's gotta have... Icy, somewhere. Some tritium in there, yeah. Rock 
Lucky and Metal Rich, so no, not that ring. I found some way back, you know, behind me, but that's not gonna help you, because... Oh, shit. Oh, that was close. My FSD just malfunctioned in the fucking tail. It always malfunctions yeah. in the tail. That's when you what know. Sh what ship? I'm in a Type 10. I am in my Semis. Let me get away from this. Uh, make sure I'm away from the star so I can... Do you have to be dropped in normal space to use the AFMU? Yes. Well, no. But if you're wanting to repair your FSD, you have to turn the module off to use it. And the FSD is what keeps you in Super Cruise, so... Oh, okay. I thought so, oh. I just couldn't remember. A little bit of deductive Good. logic there. Mm. Alright, no, we're good. Thanks. Oh, no problem. I am uh my exploration ship is a type ten. She's a big She's a big one. Uh, I love her. Hello. She's my baby. What are you? Painite? Rod Plumsite? Alright, let's see here. What's mm -hmm. this? Monazite? Serendibite? Serendibite? Platinum? Oh, I do not see. 10% to go. That freaked me out because it was like warning taking damage, and I was like, no, 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 die. <laughs> metal rich, metal rich, metal rich rings. There's no freaking trudy in there. There's no IC rings in this system. That sucks. Does that mean you're gonna have to like look around the area to see if you can find any? Almost. Thank you. Oh, uh, I'm actually a part of a training squadron, so if you have any questions about Elite Dangerous, feel free to ask. And we will laugh and joke and make fun of you. No, I'm playing. We yeah, will do that. We will answer to the best of our abilities. What'd you say, Hex? that frame shift. No problem. I usually stream Monday through Saturday, so. I don't stream on Sundays, but I stream Monday through Saturday. Sometime during the day. <laughs> I don't really have a schedule. I just stream when I can. Um. So, just out of sheer <laughs> morbid curiosity, if there are no... There are no icy rings in this system. It's all metal rich and rocks. Well, if you uh, type exclamation point YouTube, I actually have a playlist of Elite Dangerous tutorials in uh, or on my YouTube channel. I'm not monetized, not fishing for reviews, and just they're there to help people that are new to the game. I've got like 12, I think videos like just uh, to answer some questions that a lot of people have asked me uh, as beginners to the game right, let's try this again uh, ju just type exclamation point YouTube and it will put the link in my chat Uh, no space between the exclamation point and YouTube. I'm not gonna take my hands off the controller right now because I am trying to feel screwed from a new one. It's not the, the safest procedure to be putting the controller down in.
Where the hell is... Did I just skip the new turn? Oh wow, I'm not far away from it already. God, this one is so tiny. It's so hard to charge off small ones. <sighs> it is so frustrating. Yeah, that's... Um, I don't know what video it takes you to or where on my channel that takes you to. I just know it takes you to my channel on YouTube. I did put two more tutorials up today. A brown dwarf. Regarding exploration. Actually, I think I did three today. There we go. Finally freaking charged the FSD. Alright. Now we can keep going. I think I've actually discovered this before on, not discovered it myself, but I've actually been to the system I'm currently in, but I was in my DBX on my different yes. account. I am. Whoa. Hello. Whoa, that was, that'll throw you into a seizure. <laughs> wow. Mm-hmm. Um, I have played PC games before when I was a kid, but that was just on my mom's computer. I've never really been a PC player. Most of the players on Elite, uh, the stream Elite are PC players, but there are a few of us PS4 players out there. That's actually with the PS4 in my title. It's a place I didn't it's realize a I was orbiting a brown dwarf. Um, how you doing? Really? And I just crashed into the damn thing. Uh, literally just... F that sucked. I was looking Hi, at brown you. dwarf. How I you doing? I was looking at your stream and I almost crashed into the... Well, I was not looking at my stream apparently and I did crash so <laughs> I was like super close uh past winter missions are fun I've I've tried to do a couple of them both of them failed though I I usually do wing trade uh with my squadron to get money and then um I I have multiple accounts on PlayStation 4 for elite games that I use I have four accounts for elite but I use uh, two of them mainly. One is just for uh, new players and finding new players when the game's on sale. For the record, people, don't super cruise assist orbit a brown dwarf. <laughs> um, uh, let me type it. It's easier just to. This is. I was about to say, man. What the hell? Not a problem. And this is his YouTube. Uh, he streams on YouTube, the other voice you hear in the party right Paynite. now. Paynite. Um, Too bad this guy don't want any Paynite, and he can't run his ship off of Paynite. <laughs> uh, he also uh, live streams, but he live streams YouTube, and he does uh, answer questions if you have any questions as well. Yes. So, there's that. And neither one of us are monetized. We just do it to help people. You can't always get what you want. <laughs> and uh, the other voice is also my husband. <laughs> we are in the same home. What state are we in? Uh, we're in Kentucky. But if you try sometimes, you just might find you get what you need. Oh, yeah. We may fundamentally disagree on the facts of life itself, but we will always agree, regardless of your motives, that you are worthy of helping. Chrome says hi to everyone in the party. Greetings to everyone in the party. Hey, where's Hicks go? You're burning my muffins. It's been long enough. Oh, okay, thank you. I appreciate that. 
Did I really? Couldn't have the last one. Um. And thank you for the follow on Twitch. And. If you have any other questions to ask about Elite, feel free to ask, and I will answer them to the best of my ability. I am kind of out in the middle of nowhere right now, so I can't really show you tutorials for inside the bubble, but... Sure you can't. You got another account. Well, not on this particular stream. Oh. I'd have to switch accounts and change stream and restart my stream and stuff just to be able to do it. Mm -hmm. I could do it if, I, if you really wanted me to, but... Um, I, I am going to Beagle Point, which is the furthest point away from the populated area that you can go. Well, I am not going to be there for a little while, at least not in this account. <laughs> but I'm having fun. Oh, that's okay. Uh, we actually have a lot of friends that are in different time zones. We don't mind. Oh, in case you ten. guys wonder what this damn nebula looks like from this angle, I will show you as soon as I get this headed this way. There we are right there. Yeah. Okay. Space boobs. What? <laughs> the muffins are done. I, I hope so. I, I told you you were burning my muffins like two minutes ago. No, they're perfect. Well, where's mine? Speaking of muffins, when are you going to make me some muffins? Yeah, Paul Hex, when are you going to make us muffins? Uh-huh. Okay, Fox. I just got into this system. I just blew my horn. And the planet that I'm targeting right now is 67,000... 756.73 light seconds away from me. Awesome. Rewind and watch last stream. Go ahead. Okay. Rewind and watch it. Okay. Water world. Would you look at that? Is it discovered? Uh, of course. Mm. No fun then. This whole system's discovered, so there's no point in scanning it. So I'm gonna keep going. These muffins are really good. <laughs> I hope so. They're really, They're really hot. Otherwise, you're wasting your fucking time. <laughs> and your ingredients as well. <clears throat> if you don't want them, you know. <clears throat> Excuse me. Maybe we'll fly. Uh, we actually don't usually go to bed till 3 in the morning our time, so we're kind of on a backward schedule already anyway. We want to fix it, but we have to wait until after we... Uh, Stop going Do the to thing. the gym. At, well, we have a schedule that we go to the gym at one in the morning. So when we go to the gym at one in the morning, if we fix our sleep schedule and we're not even... What time is it right now? Uh, it's 2.10 for me. 2.10 2 in the morning. It's 3.10. I gotta go to bed. But you're eating muffins. I'm gonna lay in bed eat muffins and watch We Netflix. represent... The Muffin Man memes, the Muffin Man memes, the Muffin Man memes. Well, enjoy your muffins and save me uh, some, call sign. <laughs> no promises. Fuck you, you fucking uppity oh. bitch. No promises. I'll fucking fuck hey. you and all your lesbian fish-eating fucking friends in front of your fucking mothers. Calm down. You want Eat muffin, shit. Man. Eat my shit. 
This is so aggressive. I know, right? <laughs> that muffin sounds so good. Just to put, by the way, you're talking with your mouth so full. He's just like, nom, nom, Hex, nom, before nom. you go to bed, you have to look something up on YouTube with me. For me, not not with me. I've already seen it, but. What? You have to look up Adam Sandler, Toll Booth Willie. I think I've seen that. Oh, you just, you just it's like a little two minute skit you gotta watch it before uh, before you go to bed yeah I already heard that when you fucking unoriginal bastard what was it called again? toll booth willy toll booth willy mm -hmm. there we go I think it's one word it might not be one word I don't know so nope. did you make two words. regular size toll booth is two words or toll booth is one word two words Two words, Did okay. Make the minis? <laughs> He's gonna watch right now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. 28 jumps. My next checkpoint. Uh, will I get there before 3 a.m.? You just started work? Yeah, I'm about to go to bed. <laughs> but when we fix our sleep schedules, I'll be up sooner in the rest of the day. Uh, we'll fix our schedule at the end of next week. Yeah. We go to the gym at 1 in the morning, and we're no longer going to be doing that after next week. So, once we're done with that... I'm definitely tired. I actually was ready for bed at like 9 p.m. Okay. So, pretty tired. <laughs> uh, well, I would hope your boss wouldn't let you go to sleep at work. <laughs> Dollar twenty five and go fuck yourself. That's called a neutron star. Uh, by flying through the tail and charging my FSD, it allows my jump range to get to 181.88 light years, when my original jump range is 44. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a lot of people use it so they can jump really far when they're trying to travel somewhere. There are some that look similar, and they're called white dwarfs. Those are a lot more dangerous, and they don't give you anywhere near as much as a jump. Okay. You'll get there. I've got a fan. Alright, I'm calling it tonight. Copy <laughs> right. that, Chief. Good night. night, call sick. Calls in, save me muffins, and come and join our party tomorrow. You you have to. Yeah. It's reserved. You've got a spot reserved especially for you. Cool. But technically it would be today, because it's Well, anyway, I found a tritium hotspot nearby. Really? 
Yep. Good night. His muffins sounded so good just by the way he was eating them, man. I wanted some muffins. <laughs> Go make me some. Oh, um, my husband's jump range is what, 80? Yeah, like 80 that? and a half. Um, Type 10s are actually combat ships. Uh, these are not regular exploration ships. Um, I just chose this ship because it is the closest ship that resembles nine, no, 80, eight zero. Um, but still, yes, pretty close. I need a fuel star. My fuel's looking kind of low down there on that bottom right corner over there. Okay, there's five. Okay, so he discovered the neutron, but nothing else. So I have to discover everything else because Who? he, whoever discovered this neutron, they just mm. discovered the star and left the rest of the system undiscovered. So. Hmm. Funny how that works. Yeah, I've got to scan it, so um, it will be discovered. I think you just proved yourself wrong there. How did I prove myself wrong? I said if you jump into a system, you honk the horn and go into the system map. If it ha has already been discovered, then it will show. Right. It hasn't been discovered. The only thing exactly. that showed was the neutron that was already discovered. The rest has not, so those that will have my name on it. Because and I in the instances where there are discovered. bodies close to the star, and they came through, and their passive scanners got it, and they didn't blow their fucking horn or anything, guess what happens? That means the rest of the system is undiscovered. Exactly. Nobody's name is on that. However, the main star is discovered. You blew the horn. Okay. dun da da, -da. You proved my point. How did I prove your point? I said the system has to be discovered already to show up in the system map. If it's not discovered, then it's not there. But it's already been discovered. There's a name on it. On the star that he hopped in and used, yeah. Right. See, now, now you're trying to, now you're trying to fucking splice you're and bits and pieces. You're not understanding what I'm trying to say here. You're not understanding what the argument was. Whatever. When you jump into a system and you honk the horn, if it has already been discovered by the somebody, system, the system map will show everybody in that system. Everybody in that system, if right. it has been discovered, will right. show in the system map, yes. Yes. It, if it has not been discovered by someone, no, it's not going to show up. But it's possible to partially discover a system without discovering yeah. all of it. I never Thank said you. it wasn't. I never that said it was wasn't. That was the actual argument. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. That wasn't my argument. My argument was well, if the get system on the right has already fucking been page. discovered. Don't argue with someone if you don't know what you're fucking arguing there. about. You told me I was wrong for you what are. I said, and no, I was not. When you honk the horn in a system you have never been in, if somebody has already discovered it and you open the system map, everything will show up on the system map. Only the things that have been discovered. Yes, only the things that have been discovered, yes. That is accurate. You're cutting up pretty good. Because I'm here. eating. Oh, no. well... If it has not been discovered, then no, it's not going to be in the system map. That's how you know if it's your system or not. No, it ain't. That's how, how I know. know whether or not you can get some of that system. Well, because the body is immediately close, meaning within 5,000 seconds of the main star, they will passively scan if they jump, don't hit the button. Mm -hmm. I can hear it. It, was, it sounds like you're at the crock pot. I say this is amazing. Shut the fuck up and baby. <laughs> <laughs> uh, women are not always right, by the way. Um, they can think they are all they want, but uh, women are no. rarely ever right. Uh huh. Um. The women who say that they're women are of right the opinion that they are good them. at sucking dick. Only about one percent of them is correct in that. Uh, okay, that's uh, nowhere near the topic we were on, but that's all right. 
I just looked um, down for a split was, second. Was the, subject, was the subject whether or not women are right? Or think they're right? Uh, he said, women are all never wrong. My girlfriend told me that. And since right. women are never wrong, I accepted it. That's what he right. said. Beta male! Oh my god, stop. <laughs> but answer my question. Was the subject matter whether or not women are always right? I mean, I guess in, in that aspect, yeah. Then I was definitely on the subject. Well. Um. Beta! <laughs> Sorry. I'm going too fast. It's a knee-jerk reaction. It spit me out. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Don't get me. Not my neutron. Mm. But they're my stars. Mm -hmm. The person didn't even honk the horn in this system. <laughs> because <laughs> they flew through, got the main star, and then it picked up within I, 5,000 life seconds and then moved I on. I can't hear you. Then shut up and stop interrupting me. It's not me interrupting you. All I hear is static. Thought you couldn't hear me. There is no burn going on here. <laughs> oh my god, it didn't charge me again. Third time's the charm. <laughs> Fucking neutron, so small. Mm -hmm. He's over there munching at the crock pot, and his mic doesn't reach there, so he'll be back in a little bit to where we can actually have. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> um. I heard those nom noms pretty clear, so we That's because I'm walk. getting back. I'm getting yeah. back close to this. <laughs> mm. You know what's amazing? What? What did you just say? Glance at my stream real quick. You know what's amazing? That's pretty. You see the nebula in the middle of that yes. hot spot? I didn't do that on purpose. That's it's where like the, the fleet carrier is in that nebula that needs that hot spot. Aw, that's so cute. Yep, that was an accident. <laughs> I wish you could, like, send him a picture and be like, hey, look. No, I'm saying the guy jumped in the system and he discovered only a neutron. He didn't honk the horn because if he honked the horn, he would have discovered all the stars stars aren't even discovered here, so he didn't even honk the horn. Dude just bucky balled, I guess. Charged and left. That's amazing! Okay, two more things to find. Uh, it's not tiny, it's just really cold in space, okay? It'll get bigger. Right. I, I, don't, I don't know if that it means, I, I don't know. The neutron star is pretty tiny. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to be a thing. Uh, neutron stars are quite dangerous if you don't know how to use them. And, uh, and if you're curious as to how they can so. be dangerous, um, watch my stream from two days ago. I got he killed died. in one. He died, yeah. It that was him. amazing. <laughs> I laughed my ass off. It's okay, I multi-crewed with him so he didn't have to die alone. Oh, yeah. She got to watch me die. It's like, it's okay, hun. I'm here in hologram, so you don't have to die alone. Wait. Yeah, there you go. I'm still alone. But it doesn't appear to be that way. Right. Oh my god. Neutron, neutron, neutron. I'm like. Colleen, there. I fed you, girl. Alright. You're not these starving. Two bodies. Ah, oh, someone got the neutron, but they didn't get the body, so the body will be mine. Body pop! Oh yeah! Gummy, 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 gummy. Yeah, that's my husband. Uh, he's in the living room. The one munching his ass off at the crock pot. Oh great, we have a phantom planet somewhere. That's probably why they only discovered the neutron. I play in the yeah. living room, she plays in the bedroom. Yes. She likes to stream half naked you know she usually only wears a top I mean he's not wrong I'm not gonna lie and say he's lying or anything he's being honest 
I don't like clothing, but since I have a camera on, I kind of am obligated to, to wear some. Something. Charge me, you little fuck. Okay, thank you. One second. My ears are starting to hurt, so I had to adjust my headset. Who plays with clothes on? <laughs> uh, I am actually an affiliate on Twitch, so I kind of have to play with clothes on. At least some clothes on. Yeah, I might get banned if I don't. And I don't want to lose my Twitch channel. I've already uh, put a lot of work into it. So. <laughs> I try to at least obey the TOS. It's kind of like work. You can't show up naked. Since this is my job, I can't show up naked. <laughs> At least I can't appear Unless to me. you are a cam girl. With pasties on their nipples painting their bodies. Oh no, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about an actual cam girl. Oh, I don't know what that means. Um Is that like a only fans? Lady? Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Live porn. Yeah. You People love watching that shit, man. Uh I'm sure you I mean they do. What do you want, kitty cat? She wants something. What do you want? She thinks she wants food, but she doesn't. Are you uh, imagining you're starving to death? Our cat has this issue to where if she eats to the bottom of her bowl, she thinks she's going to die. So she comes and bothers us until we put food on the bottom. Okay, that aggravates me. <laughs> I'm assuming you're married, hopefully, or or you said girlfriend, so you have a girlfriend, so. Charge me. Let me out. Uh, yeah, if you drop out in the Neutron Star, you're pretty much toast if you don't know how to get out. And you don't have the proper ship to get out. There's another jump, so. <coughs> Excuse me. This is my kitty cat. Her name is Colleen. She's sitting on my leg. I don't know why. She's purring. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. He was a stray. We picked her up a few years ago. Oh, thank goodness the fuel star. I know the, f the I'm supposed to trust that route plotter, but I don't know if I do. It puts me pretty low sometimes. It's like, oh, you can barely make it. Let's do it anyway. I was like, bruh. How many more jumps do I got? 20. What time is it? 2.30. Can I make 20 jumps in 30 minutes? Can I, can I, can I? I don't think so, but we'll stop. I'm gonna land and then probably end the stream and when I start up tomorrow I will make the decision whether or not to go mine some tritium for him. You bookmark where you found some or Nah it ain't hard to find, it's just the closest system. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, it's literally one jump over. Two two point right. eight light years. Uh, two point eight five to be exact. Ian. Well if you mine it'll give me time to catch up to you. So, here's that.
been noticing little indicators of non-discovery as I've been exploring. If you jump into a system... Yes, Chaotic Fox is the one in the living room. Yes, that is my husband. Woohoo! Um, yeah, well, howdy! So, apparently, when you jump into a system and it's not discovered, the star is not on, like your radar is empty. Um, and then when you get close enough to the star or you blow your horn, the stars will show up in the radar. And then you go to the system app and it'll only show stars after you blow the horn. And whatever you've cl flown closest to. Um, that's one way to see if it's been discovered, but sometimes, like, you don't pay attention and you see the star already, so make sure you always open the system map because you just gotta make sure. Alright. Thanks for watching, guys. I had fun tonight. Hope you guys had fun. Going to be ending the stream there. Thanks for tuning in till the end. If indeed, if indeed you did, if you didn't, you can't hear what I said. <laughs> so be sure to leave a like, subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down, unsub, whatever your thing is. Enjoy your night. I'm going to bed. <laughs>